Sarnix, do you not know who Rayanera is? Have you not a chat? Do you know who Rayanera is? Do you know who my girl, who my one and only Rayanera is? I, I am in. I am. I am shocked. I am in disbelief. I cannot believe. I cannot believe this. My own mod does not know my little stinky baby poopy poopy pants. <laughs> I'm just tweeting that I'm live. Don't worry, chat. Give me one second. Actually, chat, can you help me pick a selfie? They're the exact same. They're literally the exact... Oh, hi. They're the exact same, but obviously one is like marginally better than the other. Um, so it's between this one, oh, you can't even like, this one, and this one, okay, that one, and that one. <laughs> one has the back of Orshifon's head, <laughs> and the other one has no Orshifon. <laughs> I didn't know Ray was short for Rayanera. Oh yeah. If you see anybody refer to Ray as like Ray with the R with the with the E apostrophe, that's Miss Rayanera. Number two does have Evie. No Orshifon, but more Booba. You're right. Obviously the one with Orshifon. Okay, you know what? Let me look at them. So the one with Orshifon, my skin looks better, but the one without Orshifon, Booba looking kinda good. The Booba Doobie looking kinda good. Live on Twitch. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Syra. Um, bring your shadows because we only have a few more quests until until we complete the Stormblood, the post Stormblood patches. Am I going to cry? Probably. Did, oh, wait, let me change that. Did I? Hmm. What, what's, what's, hmm. Hmm. What do I, do I say? I've got, oh, I know. Should I, oh. Got her thank you for two months. Should I have a tissue box on stage? No, that's gonna sound horny. I'm prepared to cry. I'm prepared to cry some more. Yeah? I'm, a, I'm prepared to cry some more. Is that good? No. No, I'm just gonna leave it. I'm just gonna leave it. Bring your shadows because we only have a few more quests until we complete the post trumble patches. Yeah. All right. I tweeted! <laughs> I did it! I did the tweet! I did the thing! Twitch, I did it! I did it. I'm a good streamer. I'm a good content creator. I'm doing my job. <laughs> I did the thing. Hold on. Where's the tweet? Let me copy it. Here we go. I did the thing. Go give it a like. Go give it a reply. Go give it a retweet. Whatever. Let's do the algorithm shenanigans and what have you. How is everyone doing? How are we all? Are we all good? I'm good. I am so, 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 so excited. I've been looking forward to- Oh, I just noticed my music is kind of- Oh, it's actually not allowed. I've been looking forward for- Like, I've been looking forward for this for so long. I've wanted to be done with Stormblood for weeks. And it's finally happening. It's finally, finally coming to a conclusion. I'm nervous, though. I'm nervous. I'm scared. I'm scared that something is gonna happen to the twins and I don't think I'm emotionally prepared for that. I started off 
I mean, if, if y'all have been watching me play this since uh, A Realm Reborn, you would know that I was not Alfino's biggest fan. I did not like him. And I think it was just, you know, I think it was just the intro to him. You know, he's a cocky little shit. Qu a cocky little twat, if you will. And, you know, the voice acting also kind of killed it for me. Um, but then come Heaven's Ward, whew, not even just Heaven's Ward, just the post A Realm Reborn content, it really saved him. And now he's like one of my favorite characters. Him and, and Alize, I love them. I love them so, 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 so much. And I'm really scared. I'm really scared that something bad is going to happen to them. He's a twin, eh? Alfie, no! Alfie, no! Oh, oh hi! Hi, Jin. Hello. Finally, it's time for the best expansion of the story. Ah! I have heard such good things about Shadowbringers. I know it's a favorite for a lot of people. Is that how I'm gonna sound at the end of all this, of all the pre, the pre Shadowbringer stuff? <laughs> Thank you, dentist, for the ten gifted subs. I appreciate it. Everybody, I get to sub with the comments, your badge must and your stay. Hi, Kelsey. Kelsey, I saw you sweeping me. <laughs> Thank you for sweeping my dead body. I appreciate it. Is this the one where Sephiroth uh, shows up? Uh, this is the one where Goku does the Kamehameha, actually. We need the booba to bring in as many folks in to witness the mascara run. So the reason why I'm wearing this top again is because I, I made a tweet. So I made a tweet, um, a draft rather, and this is this is the tweet. Um, tweet is, uh, so I finished Stormblood. And it's me screaming and crying. I have not tweeted it yet. So as you all know, um, the the I, I tweeted the Orshifon tweets like so I got to that one part in uh, Heaven's Ward, and it did so well that even like the Final Fantasy Online Twitter acknowledged me, which was hilarious. Um, and so I'm holding on to that tweet because I haven't finished Stormblood completely, technically, because we're still in the post Stormblood content. So I'm, I'm letting it sit. I'm letting it simmer. I'm going to see if something else happens tonight and see if I cry so I can just put more chaos into that because I have been feeling things. And it's funny. And it's funny because like the only reason why, like to quote Jay, the only reason why I've been crying in Stormblood was because I've been remembering Heaven's Word. <laughs> so I'm waiting. I'm waiting for this game to knock me down and beat me up, to kick me in my stomach. To kick my little tummy wummy. <laughs> we might have new photos for that tweet. Oh no. Get your screen caps ready. Get ready to clip. I want all the goodies. I'm gonna try to also make some uh, TikTok content of my my um, Final Fantasy extravaganza. See uh, see if we can get some, some good content rolling. Your ears are iconic. They give me life. Thank you. I, I'm obsessed with them. I never really understood the cat girl stuff until I became a Makote and got these ears. <coughs> but like, not like e-girl cat girl, like, ooh, well, I mean, ooh, well, I am kind of that. But, like, you know, there's just, there's something about this that just makes me feel superior. <laughs> they are simply attached to my head, yes. These are actually a part of my, my head. These grew out my head. There, it's not a headband. Um, sorry, I'm just gonna check my heat real quick, cause like, it's hot in here. Um, and it's not even on, so it's probably my PC that's killing me. Let me open my window. Do not, do not look at me. Do not perceive! Do not perceive me! Did it. Sorry, it's Pepper Pepper, sorry, it's true. We are just, um, symbiotic. Perhaps a real Final Fantasy the shadows we brought along the way. <laughs> Yes, you are absolutely right. I don't know what that means. Like, Shadowbringers. What are the shadows referencing the Asians? Why? Why are they being brought? I like. I don't. I. I genuinely do not know what to expect, and I'm. I'm very excited. Unfortunately, as most of you know, and if you don't, you're. you're I don't know. So I. 
Um, I have very bad memory thanks to trauma and mental disorders. So I struggle with remembering the plot line for this game, which is very, very embarrassing. But I pick it up like as I go. Like I remember it as like I keep playing. Um, so where did we fucking leave off <laughs> is what I'm asking. Um, what's her face just died, right? We just fought, what's her face? Y'all see you, right? She got her memories back and she killed her parents. And then, uh, uh, oh, sorry. It was like way shinier than my, why is it so shiny? Um, cause my tongue has been like clipping on it. I'm wondering. I'm wondering if I like fucked it up. No, I ain't watching. I ain't rewatching no cutscene. No, I'm saving my cutscene juice for the rest of this. Um. Yeah, 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 yeah. So she got her memories back. She killed her parents, and then she went all like, "Oh, I'm, I'm joining back. Uh, vengeance or whatever." Um. And then what they had, when they went to exchange um, captives, like Lord Hien, um, with Asahi, I believe his name was, in those like con containers that he had, it was a bunch of like crystals. They fucking turned her into a fucking primal. It was like a, it was a summoning. And then she turned into like this beautiful, like, you know, whatever. Um, primal and then and then we killed her and then she shish kebab her brother which is what I wanted to do so I I love that because I was telling y'all that I wanted to shish kebab him and she shish kebabbed him amazing iconic love that for her but also don't like her um so they both died and I think we oh 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 where mm, uh, mm, mm. and we played as Alfino Alfino was gone with the Garleans or whatever he went to go and uh, uh, to go with the to go to Garlemald um because they're molding now and he met an Asian hunter and he had a bunch of like Asian masks on his and his thing um and I think he's I think he's someone that I fought before is he bringing the shadows <laughs> he I've I've because in combat, when we were playing as Elf, you know, he was fighting with us, and his, like, his, like, his, like, I've seen that shit, but I don't know if it's just, like, Garlean magic or, or what, but it was cool. It was cool. Um, Alize is kind of losing her mind because she hasn't found contact with Alfino, um, and the only thing that they picked up was the burn, like, from his, like, little the link pearl um what else um and then we went to go investigate the burn and now we're Ishtola's is putting two and two together or something like that right am i missing anything that's like the gist of it right blue elfino or red elfino blue elfino not alize because alize is red elfino right That was not coherent. Sorry, man. <laughs> uh, unable to use the menu because they came into me either. Whatever. Whatever. Hi, Ken. That's pretty much it. Today's burning question. Where are the shadows? <laughs> Will they be brought? <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> also missing a corpse. We're missing a corpse? Oh! 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 I forgot! Yes, Ashley Tisdale lives. <laughs> Ashley Tisdale lives. She lives. She lives to see another another sequel to High School Musical. <laughs> the corpse is missing, and we believe that an Asian is controlling the body. There's some paranormal, like sleepwalking. Uh, what is it called when the when the, when a demon has like. What's, what's the word when a demon like takes over your body? Not possession, um, like astral projection? No, it's not astral projection, but whatever. That shit. 
Yeah, that's happening. Possessi? What is poss? Girl, dreamwalking? No, it's like when when you're like dead or like asleep and a demon. Ta well, I guess just possession. Just possession. Asian project. Get out. Get out. <laughs> Neck romancing. Is that when a vampire makes out with your neck? I guess vampires are used to neck romancing. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, I think that's it. Asher Tizzle in the game. Ariana Grande isn't the only canonical pop star in Final Fantasy. Ariana Grande is in Final Fantasy? What? Shadow walking. Ah. Uh, so the shadows are not only being brought, they're being walked over. All right, look at your husband not even sheltering you from the rain in game. <laughs> the audacity, the audacity. One is sweeping, the other is just standing there. How dare they? She was a character in one of the mobile games? That's very funny. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm very hungry and I forgot to make food and I also forgot to order food. <laughs> Do I order food now or should we just dive in and then during a cutscene I order? Was was the plan? Oh yeah, Ariana Grande was in Fortnite. Did she have like a concert in Fortnite? What a time! What order food now? Girl. What do I order? What do I get? What do I get? What do I get? You need these cutscenes, order now, no distractions. True. It is, it is picking up, right? It does, it really does feel like the game. So I was, okay, so let's, let, you know what? You know what? Let me order food and then we'll have this discussion because I want to have a discussion real quick about um, Yeltsu. If y'all don't mind, because I know y'all sent for her. What do I get? Do I get more Popeyes? Do I shit my pants? <gasps> oh no, I'm going to get roti. That's what I want. Classic roti. Uh, tofu. No, paneer. Paneer. Um, masala. Medium spice. No, mild spice. Because I don't want to have uh, the shits while I'm... Actually, no. I'll be fine. No. Just in case. Because I don't want to have to be running back and forth like during all this. Um, and I'm also going to get... I'm going to get... Should I get some... Some chat? Did I get some chat? Mm, I do. I do, I absolutely do. What? Ah, they were the 40 months. Hello. All right. So, this is the discussion that I want to have. You simp for her too? I do not. She's hot? Okay, you know what? No, I do simp for her, but I, I don't. I simp for her in the way that I simp for Solace. Was there text-to-speech with that? <laughs> no. But then just thank you for the $20. Wow! So, I can't wait to live at KLC3 with the Indian food. Kelsey, one of these days, I'm gonna drag your ass to Toronto. And we're we're gonna go out for some good nummies, okay? So, I don't simp for her. I'm sympathetic towards her, but glad she and her brother are gone. Yes! This is exactly how I feel. I'm gonna shit my pants again, don't worry. I got a bathroom for you and a cute dog to cheer you on. <laughs> so here's my thing with Yatsuyu. I do, I do feel for her. Her, her life was not easy. And it's sad that she had to go through everything that she went through. My problem is, and this is a really big issue that I find with a lot of like, not even, not even like fa- I don't suffer Suyu or Yotsu, I suffer Sukiyomi. Me too! Okay, me too, me too, me too, me too. So, yeah. I, um, I have a very big problem with media trying to humanize villains. Um, I just feel like it doesn't, it doesn't hit me the way that it might hit other people. And I'm gonna use Solus as an example. I love that character. I think he is so well written. He's one of my favorite villains in video games. Um... And this is not because I, I I I romance him or anything. If anyone actually knows me, I do romance him. I love romancing him. I think it's tragic, but I am not on the I can fix him side. I'm on the this guy needs to to be put to rest because he wants to commit mass genocide and does not 
care about the aftermath. He only cares about restoring, like, the Elvenon, you know? Um, and I feel like, and I feel like that's how I feel with Yatsuyu, because she doubled down so hard once she got her memories back. She wanted to end it all. She wanted to, she was going to commit suicide. And that, that did get me. But then she immediately went back to, like, the Imperials. You know? I feel like no one else could have killed her brother but her. I feel like that was, like, a good end. You know? But again... I'm, I don't, I don't think she's a, she, for me, qualifies as a character where it's like, I can fix them. Nope. She could have, uh, Gosetsu tried fixing her. Look what happened, right? Um, I think it was just terrible. I, I guess it just like was sad because her brother was meddling and stuff. And maybe she could have uh, lived on as Suyu. Who knows? But I, I think it's cheap. I think it's really, really, really cheap that they just threw amnesia on her and was like, yep, there you go. Now she, uh, uh, now you have to feel bad for her. Do you know what I mean? And I, I think that is very fucking cheap. You know? A redemption, I think a character, sorry, I just like, my mouth farted. I think if you want to give a character a redemption arc, they need to, they need to actively redeem themselves and not be like, oh, well, she doesn't remember anything. You have to feel bad. No! And, and it's explored in the way where, you know, um, uh, some of the people who have uh, felt the impact of her wrath, you know, they said the same things. They said uh, things where it was like, um, I don't forgive you, but I, but I will, I will spare you, you know, like, and I think that I like that. That's, that's my standpoint. You know, you can't forgive these people for their actions and you shouldn't have to. These people should not have to. And it's, it's, it's very cheap, not so much in this game, but in general, when they try to force the audience to, to sympathize and in such a degree where you will also go down the path of like forgiving them. This little window, if she could have been something else, but she isn't, she's a monster. Yes. And honestly, that I like. I like it when bad people are bad. I think trauma endured does not excuse trauma inflicted. Yes. Yes. Um, I think, um, I lost my train of thought with that. <laughs> um, but yes, let villains, let villains be villains. Let villains be bad. Jamie and Cersei. I'm not going to touch on, on Jamie, but Cersei, Cersei's a bad bitch. And I don't mean that in a good way. She is rotten. She's an awful person. And I think that's why I love her character. And the same thing with Joffrey. I fucking hated Joffrey. But my god, was he a good villain. And that I can respect. I can, I can say that I love those characters. I love those villains. I'm not gonna fix them. But I love them. I love a well-written villain. I just do not want to be force-fed, you know... I too love bad bitches. I too, I too love bad bitches. <laughs> you ain't thinking for the five month resub. He was spoiled a little shit. I know, but like, Cer Cersei was the was the was the great villain. But with Joffrey, I loved to hate him. Do you know what I mean? I hated him so much, but I I loved hating him. Does that make sense? That actor, he killed it. He was great. He was amazing. Yeah, those are the best villains. I love that. Here, let me scroll up and, ch and chat a little bit. <laughs> I trust your judgment. If you don't like y'all see you, then me too. <laughs> hey, Red. Hello. That kid did a great job. I want to punch his face. Yep, that's a good fucking actor. He was very believable. I actually could see you with the 15 months. Thank you. What is this? Girl, I'm not watching this right now. Let's see. Oh, great! I'm getting mad about Jamie and Cersei's ending again. I know. That's why I don't want to talk about Jamie. There was so much potential with that character. But again, no, that, that... No, I don't even... No, I... I, I'm, I'm... 
I'm very, I'm very, I'm very like weird about Jamie and Cersei. No, you know what? Let, let, let me, let me spitball for a little bit. I'm very weird about it because I do, I do think Jamie's redemption arc was so good and they tossed it down the drain. But I do, actually no. You know what I was gonna say? I was gonna say, I love that his love for his sister was real, but that means I support incest. And I want you to know, I do not. I do not support them. But <laughs> why are you kink shaming? I, oh, do you want to fuck your siblings? I sure don't. <laughs> no, no, no! I don't support incest. I don't like villain. Sorry, I'm reading. I'm going up, and I'm reading um everyone's uh pings. I don't like villain redemption arcs where the victims are guilted into forgiving their abuse by Jupiter's power of forgiveness. Yeah! Freely given forgiveness? I fuck with that. I think forgiveness... Care- Stop it! Chat! Come on! Back. Hey! Hey! Come on! Move on! Move on! So what uh, house of- Okay, look. Okay, hold on. I know I said move on, but hold on. Look. Listen. 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 If my uncle looked like that, I'd act up too. If... I'd act up too. You know what? It hasn't it hasn't gotten bigger. It's not a bigger hype train, so you know what? It's fine. Y'all ain't hyping up the incest that much, so we're good. <laughs> Can't move on from Sire and not not she got me simping out of my mind. I don't blame you. <laughs> Twitch trying to say something? Yo, Twitch supports incest too, apparently. I mean two? I I do not! <laughs> Anyway. <laughs> what were we talking about? Oh yeah, we were talking about Yatsu, right? <laughs> well. Guy! <laughs> Guy, thank you for the gifted sub! Bianjo, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, welcome to come to your bedroom What's on your stay. Sue you and her brother, which suddenly has a new context. No, I mean, you know what? They were partners in crime at the end. He's literally her step bro. What are you doing with those crystals, step bro? Okay. Ah! Step bro, I <laughs> Step bro, you've turned me into a primal. 
Oh my god, step bro. <laughs> okay, let's get into the fucking game. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> I don't I don't want this to be the stream that gets people into incest. Not that I'm intense. <laughs> Thank you for the 110 pretty step bro. Did you bring the shadows? <laughs> Step bro, you're storming my blood. Uh, <sighs> all right, all right. Let's uh, let's get a show of hands. Who's ready? Uh, for <laughs> who's ready for uh, for Shadowbringers? <laughs> I am digging my grave. I really am. I will lie in it. I will dig this grave and I will lie in it. And Quinderella, thank you for the 27 months! Thank you! Less than three. Alright. So, real quick. I don't want this to be the stream that gets people to incest. Incest that comes later! <laughs> I disagree with you in that I don't think they tried to give Yatsuyu a redemption. I am, in my opinion, like they tried to humanize her and give her and give perspective to her evil, but I don't think they ever wholly excuse her for what she did. Her multiple characters being like, if her memories come back, she will be held accountable for what she did. I don't think the writers wanted to gloss over her actions for even a second. I mean, I agree, but I also disagree. Gangsters, what's up, guys? I just hate that shit. I hate it. I think it's cheap. I think it's so. It's not so much that like. It's not so much that um. Ah, it's it's the fact that they gave her amnesia and it's like now you have to forgive her i don't i hate that that i hate that's cheap that's so cheap maybe it was maybe if it was something more along the lines of like oh she survived and now she wants to like repent for her i don't know i think there are like other ways to explore that avenue instead of just being like she has amnesia Amnesia as a plot device is pretty played out. Yeah, it's really tacky. It's really tacky. I don't like that shit at all. All right. Y'all ready? We ready? Yeah, I feel like I feel like it could have been done so much better if they didn't if they didn't toss in the fact that she had amnesia. They could have made her character so much stronger. Like, oh my god, she does have a good side. You know, like, there is a part of her that wants to, like, do better. And she didn't need amnesia to unlock that. I think that would have made everything so much stronger. But, I mean, it's done. <laughs> yeah, and that's another thing I didn't like either. The childlike stuff, yeah. When she was like, oh my gosh, she's baby! Like, ew. Ew. There are so, there are so many... There's so many things there that are, like, slightly problematic that when you clump them all together, I just- I get the ick. I don't think they were trying to redeem her. I think they were trying to show a story where a character can't be redeemed due to consequences of actions catching up with them, even if, even if they should otherwise be innocent. Yeah, and- and that- I think, like, that's, like, what like what you're saying is what ends up happening, like, in the, like, in the... I mean, yeah, no, that that is what it is. And I do like that to agree, I, to a degree. I just hate the, the overdone trope of, oh, like, this person has amnesia now. Oh, they woke up with amnesia. Oh, blah, 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 blah. I, I, I don't like that stuff. That's a trope that I personally just despair. Despair? Despite. Despite? Despise! I cannot English. Yeah, like if Gosetsu and Yotsuyu bonded on the desert island or came to differences. Yeah, I think that would have been so good. But what I do... But what I do like... What I do like is how much that plot point with Yotsuyu... Helped Gosetsu grow. We know when Hien tells you that bit where it's like... He, he tells you about um, Gosetsu's family and how he lost them and, and that kind of stuff. Subbing respectfully. I think that was the saving grace 
in my eyes. I, I, I view a lot of the Yatsuyu plotline stuff um, as more character building for, um, character building for, for Gosatsu, a character that I fucking love. You know? Effective but lazy. Yes, I wish, I wish there was more work that went into that, that whole thing. But that's, I mean, it is what it is. Like, I'm not gonna like every uh, plot point in the game. I'm not gonna agree with everybody either. And I think that's fair. Thank you, by the way, Metroid, for the 25 months. Did they try to redeem her? No, 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 it's... So, what I'm saying is that they're using Amnesia as her crutch. Like, oh, she's Amnesia, you have to forgive her, right? And I'm, and what I said earlier, too, is I like that they showed the people who have felt the, the effects of her of her chaos, how they would tell her, I, I do not forgive you, but like, I will, like, I will let you be, like that kind of stuff. I like that. Um, but I don't know. I stand by my, um, my opinion of amnesia as a cheap, um, a cheap tactic. You know who did nothing wrong, Sir Zephyrin? Um, give me one second. Sorry, I just had to strip someone of their title real quick. Just like how I, um, killed him for stripping my man of his title and his life! Ah! Hi, Drew! Hi, Drew BB! Okay. Okay. What is... What is... What, what is this? I hate this. I hate this. I hate it. This is awful. This is terrible. All right, okay, so where am I in the- Okay, if I hear whoever the fuck is, like, crafting or just switching their glams, if I hear that one more time... Okay, so what are we doing? We are- Nope. Oh, I ha I haven't finished my roulettes. Okay. So, I was trying to do some side quests earlier, and I didn't because I was super, super sleepy, so we are working on... We're working on... We're working on... Did I even... I don't even, I didn't, I didn't even pick it up. I didn't even pick it up. Where am I? Here we go. On that note, life is good. God is is beautiful and the night is long. Peace out, my people. Goodbye, Fabio. Did you say terrible? Sorry, babes. I'm sorry, I have to find this stuff. I did say that. Now I can sit back and relax and not watch out for spoilers. Easy. Oh, wait a second. You thought that I was getting rid of you so easily? Look, if Xenos can have um, a comeback, so can you. Sorry, Ashley Tisdale. <laughs> Let me fix my my headset. I hate that it's like um I have too many cables here. I hate it. Drew, how are you um enjoying Final Fantasy? Yeah, I feel like I, I have I have two, three mods that can help me with um, Final Fantasy spoilers, and one is here. <laughs> one. I may need to. I may need to hire a few, a few new hands. All right. Let's see. So we're going all the way. I think it's like over here, right? Fuck. And I still can't fly. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Where the f where am I where am I going? Am I going up here? I'm going up here. Oh, Jay's here! Right! Jay's here! Thank God. Thank God. I have one coherent mod. I'm always here. I volunteer. Yeah, there are two. We got we got Sarnix and we have and we have Jay, so we're chilling. You forgot about me? Okay, in my defense. In, uh, hold on. Oh, hold on. <laughs> in my defense, Jay, you're not a mod in my server, and when I think of my mods, my brain shows me a picture of the mod list in my server, and you are not one of them. Um... Redemption arc. 
Be the Gosetsu to my Suyu! <laughs> I found Sarnix and Pepper. Wait, wait. Wait, I know I- wait, 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 no, wait, 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 it's, do not fucking move. Do not fucking move. I'm coming back. Sorry, doesn't even know me. I do now, heart wreck. I do now. She's gonna pick up the minor job so she can keep digging her <laughs> Alright. Where? Where? <gasps> it's a baby! It's a baby! It's a baby Drew! That's a baby Drew! That's a little booga boo! That's a little baby poopy! It's a little stinky babes! Well, I can't trade with you, and I don't know if I can add you as a friend because you're on the trial. <gasps> can I? Can I? <gasps> She's so cute! You're so cute! Look at you! Look at you and your pink hair! Look at you and your bad self! Look at you! I give you a kiss. Look, we're giving you kisses. Yeah. Hey, robot. They just can't do it? Okay. I just can't add you? Okay, perfect. Oh, am I getting headpads? Oh my god, you're giving me headpads. Thank you for the headpads. I appreciate that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you headpads too. There you go. Or, I'm petting the air. I'm so sorry. I meant to, I, I'm still, I'm, you know, I did my best. You know, I did, I did my best. And now I gotta go. I got bigger fish to fry. Oh, thank you, Sarnix, for the head pat. Wait, I'm in a party? When did I get in a party? Did I add you to- Did I- Ooh, what, when did- Did I- Did I- I invited you to my party instead of adding you as a friend? Girl. Girl. I just started stream. Amnesia. <laughs> Wait, Sarnix, what were you trying to trade with me? Or did you lie? Did you have nothing to give me, you rat? Okay, I'm going. I'm going now. Goodbye. Ray, I am being good. Chat, tell him I'm being good, right? 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 This is the last time I ever ask y'all to do anything for me. <laughs> uh, yeah, Ray, what are your opinions on incest? We are heavily against incest. We do not support it in this household. Incest is very bad. It's very gross, it's very weird, and it's very, um, southern. Nope, no unless. Unless... <laughs> No. No. Uh, uncles are even worse. Doesn't matter how hot they are. You should never fuck your uncle. <laughs> Why? Get away from me. <laughs> it's, it's, it's bad. It's gross. It's weird. And we're still southern. Exactly. You don't want to be associated with Alabama, do you? Is it Alabama? Al Alabama? Alabama? Al no, it's Alabama, right? <laughs> I can't say Alabama without being like Alabama. It's Alabama. Incest bad, but monster fucking. Look, I will not fuck a villain. I will not fuck an uncle. But a monster? Now, if the monster is both of those things... I will not be accepting uh, further questions. Uncle Hrysfalk. <laughs> Yo, Nidhogg was fine as fuck, though. I don't know what it is about dragons that do it for me. I love me a good dragon. And a bad dragon. Oh, I have... <laughs> nope. <laughs> Didn't mean it like that. I don't I don't own anything by bad dragon, but when I do, you, you guys will be the first to know. Don't worry. You will be the first to hear about it. Is that against TOS? Don't make me get the squirt bottle. What, you're gonna squirt on me? 
Okay, so where- okay, so power and slumber, it's by the docks. So it's like over here? Are we going somewhere? Where are we going? I really don't remember where we left off. Is it right here? Is it here? Do I talk to the ferry skipper? Or the dock skipper? Is it this? Okay, it is. Uh, all are free to travel in and out of the Enclave. Do you seek passage? Uh, I do. Oh. I just have to go to the dome and Enclave. Really? That's it? I could have done my, my little teleportation. Wait, is this not it? No, this is it. But where? But where? Game? Game, please assist. Game, please. I'm in, I'm in need of assistance. Do I go to- Oh, I think I have to go talk to Hien in the Hien something something, right? I don't know where the fuck that is. I'll find it, I guess. It's not this. Is it over here? Is it past the etherite? It might be past the etherite. Uh, I'm lost. I I am lost, but I'll find a way. You're not gonna tell me first? No. It's definitely not you first. Um. Okay. Is it is it this building here? Is it this? No, because there's gonna be someone outside of it. And I, oh, here it is. Found it. I thought you were in the Alamegan quarter. Was I? Was I? Was that where I was? That's even worse. No, I swear, I swear we're here. Don't gaslight me like that. Okay, I'm gonna talk to them real quick because I want to see what's up. In the field of ether etherology, the Zim. Oh yes, we're going there. I'm remembering it now. The Zim step remains unbroken ground. Having missed your last expedition through in injury, I mean to seize this opportunity with both hands. You know what I'm gonna seize with both hands? That little face of yours, because you're so cute. You still have one to pinch your cheeks. The Zim step. I always want to see it. Well, you're about to. Wait, I don't want to. I don't want to be an astro. I. What do I want to play as? Do I go back to Dragoon? With my nasty ass gear? Sure. Hien is eager to set out for the Azim Step. It is settled then. I will journey to the Azim Step with the Scions. Yugiri and Hakuro, I leave our, our other neighbors to you. Is Stola still alive? She is. Oh, Hien, I wish your voice actor wasn't too famous to be in this game anymore. What does that mean? My apologies, but I won't be joining you. But you just said you wanted to see the Azim Step! I am no etherologist, but what skills I do possess are unlikely to be of any great use to the mission. But more importantly, it seems to me that the ruins of the burn warrant attention. And so, while you are away securing an energy source, I will engage our friends at Garland Ironworks to undertake a complete overhaul of the field generators. We'll need them in good working order if our plan is to succeed. I trust there are no objections? Um, have care in the burn. Come on, Elise. Could you not get the Taro to do it? Um, have care in the burn. Have care on the step. From what I hear, the Zela like fighting with friends almost as much as foes. Good luck. Well, and she's off. There's three of us then. Very well. Should we make first for a reunion? I guess so. I guess so. Okay, we're going to reunion. If I, if I can, if I can, there we go. How does your game look so nice? Um, the quality goes up each expansion. I have streamer mode engaged. True, that as well. Streamer privileges. Did you not know that streamers get the better version of Final Fantasy XIV? And our free trial goes up to level 90 and includes all of the games, all of the X packs. That's a lie. It's not true. I wish it was though. So this is the Azim step. The tales do not do it justice. If you think the view is impressive here, wait until we reach higher ground. Actually, seeing as it's your first fillet, permit me to show you my favorite spot. Is it where we found you? That'd be really cute. Let me go have like a little little sit down over there. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure this is where we found him. Yeah! Dolly, thank you for the 14 months! Sarah love too, Sarah love too, Sarah love too. I will never tire of this vista. 
the endless fields, the boundless skies, tis a sight to make a man forget his cares. But not his purpose, I trust. Might this be a fitting moment to tell us what we are doing here? I love her voice so much. Of course. During my time with the Mole, I learned some few myths of this land. One goes thus. In the distant past, when all seemed doomed, a wayfaring soul came unto the steppe. Venturing into the northern crag, he received of Nama a sliver of her essence, a shard of the shining moon, and with it clove the tainted land from the earth. The end thus averted, to these fields did the wayfaring soul return, and venturing once more into the northern crag, he buried the shard, and made unto the heavens an offering of blood. A tainted land cloven from the earth, and an offering of blood to the heavens, as is La and Dalamud. That was my thinking, yes. And you believe that yonder mountains hide an artifact possessed of sufficient power to raise Azizla up to the heavens. I suppose that might suffice. Worth a closer look, would you say? So, I can't- I would. I cannot have these two in the same cutscene right now. With me and my undies? I'm gonna need to change them. It's gonna be so obvious. Just give me one second chat. I'm just fixing my goods real quick. Okay. So I've discovered recently that my, that like I look best with like a little bit of light instead of a lot coming from there, like instead of coming from my monitor. So I'm just going to, Gonna do a little bit of a uh, there. That's good. Those two, those I think those particular two know the effect they have on us. Oh, absolutely. My food is almost here, so we have a little bit of time. Okay, let's see what's going on here. From here, we shall travel to Mol Ilo. Is it Ilo? Ilo? I don't remember. There, there we may ask Serena about the particulars of the myth and raise the matter of an alliance with the rulers of the steppe. They want the alliance too. I remember that now. And I know that's what, um, it's not just like an alliance with Doma and them, it's an alliance with like all the nations, right? That's what, look at all these guys. If that's what Lise was pushing for, right? You just pull up a white background on your second back background. I literally pulled up Discord. I literally have Discord open right now. There's an old story that said Japan was cloven from the earth by a sword. Really? Go on, tell us more. Oh, Avika's here. Hey, Avika, what's up? Do you use light mode Discord? No, I don't, but I just turned it on. <laughs> it's a little bit jarring, but this is this this looks good, right, chat? Or does it not? What if I just like... I was trying to find light mode for... For um... OBS. But it doesn't actually exist. Oh, I think my food just arrived. My foodie just arrived! Thank you, Ghostly Chris. Thank you, Dreadwolf, Dread, Dreadwolf Solus. Oh my god, my ex is here. <laughs> god, I can't believe my ex is in the chat right now. Oh my god. I'm gonna, let me try to, let me try to make um this look good real quick. Ooh, 
that's actually not that bad. How do we feel about this? Chat, what's the verdict on this? Hi, JS. I think this is pretty good. This is pretty good, right? Yeah, we approve? Perfect. Come with the skin tone without washing you out. Yeah! All right, let me go grab my foodie. And then we will carry on. I'm really excited. I'm so, 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 so excited. I'm so glad that Ishtola is back. I love her so much. I was, I was scared she was a goner for a bit. All right, one sec. you are you stardust if not hi stardust more popeyes no 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 no. yeah i got i got roti and i am ashamed to say that i'm going to be eating it with a fork because well i am gaming i also got uh cauliflower bites oh no i didn't i got the oh yeah i got the the chat oh that smells so good oh, i wish i had pani puri oh fuck look at that Let me show y'all. Let me go here. Is it gonna focus? Can you focus? So, 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 so yummy. Alright, let me, let me take my first bite. Let me see how good it actually is. It looks so good. Chat. 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 Have a bite. This is on me, guys. Have a bite. Wait, there we go. Yummy, right? <laughs> okay. Get the headset on. Go. I am actually not on console potato head. I play on PC. I just use a controller because it's comfier for me. Mmm. Mmm. Alrighty, so now we have to go find Serena. She's all the way up here, right? Yeah, okay. I'll just do a little bit of, a little bit of running on my chocobo. I can fly! Oh my god, I could fly here. I forgot about that. Thank god. Kind of look like a KFC stacker, a snacker bowl. From the discourse here, it is apparently Indian food. Yeah, it's like a samosa. It's like a samosa that got, like, ripped up, basically. Alright, let me see if I can find a piece that's more obvious. See? Oh, wait. I don't know, I don't know if you can see. I don't know. I don't know how obvious it is, but it's re it's really good. Okay. Mm hmm Is it spicy? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I love samosas, but they're so crumbly that this is, like, perfect. Take the samosa, beat it up, give it to me like it's a food, like it's a bowl, you know? And I'm good. And I'm good to go. I'm gonna taco tonight and now I'm hungry again, so I'm gonna eat leftovers. Oh, hell yeah. Get your leftovers and get cozy. Is this game on console? It is. It's on PlayStation, I believe. 
Mmm, yeah, and Pepper. I'm glad of your visit. And the opportunity to welcome a new friend. How may we serve you? I'm so glad I have the auto text thing on. Auto text advance. And there's a matter I would discuss with the mole. It concerns not only the peoples of the steppe, but of every land in the far east. Dun dun dun. Mmm. And there's coriander sauce in this. So good. A shard of the shiny moon left behind it in a wayfaring soul. And you need this to protect our lands? Mm-hmm. Unfortunately. I do. My friends and I wish to find the shard and ascertain the extent of its power. Will you tell me more of the place where it lies buried? This northern crag? Is it gonna give me a dungeon? Mmm. Or a trial? If that is your wish. In the mountains to the north, there is a cavern called the House of the Crooked Coin. Inside this cavern are pillars of stone that legend holds to be the source of Nama's power. There, I believe, you will find what you seek. Okay. To the north in the mountains. Okay. It's giving dungeon energy or duty energy. Ah, uh, yes, I know the place. Does a brisk walk from here? And what are your thoughts on an alliance? I like how he's just shooting that out. Should the Empire return, our lands will be engulfed in a storm of conflict whether we will or no. If we do not stand together, we will fall apart. This I believe with all my heart. However... What do you mean, however? You're explaining- you just, like... With what you just said, an alliance sounds perfect! You need protection! However, that's what I'm saying. Go on, girl. Among the tribes of the steppe, there are those who revere Nama above all else. To them, the pillars are sacred and not to be disturbed. So you don't want us to go in? You proceed as you propose. Such tribes are like to spurn an alliance. Mm. Prompting others to follow their example. That is my concern. Well, I'm the warrior of light. I'm sure I'll find a way. I was by no means certain that the pillars will provide the power you seek. Ere you risk the ire of the followers of Namat, might you not first visit the house of the Crooked Coin? If all is as you hope, we may then consider how best to earn their blessing. That's fair. We have to earn it. Oh, well, thank you for gifting the sub. Sorry, I have alerts muted so they don't disrupt um, cutscenes. And thank you for your counsel. We will do as you suggest. I have no desire to give offense to those with whom I would join hands. Exactly. God, I love him. I remember someone in chat said that they remind him of Jon Snow. They're, they're, he reminds them of Jon Snow, and I agree. Thank you for your understanding. Though the mole may reign over the steppe today, this decision, this decision will shape the days to come, and we would not force others into war against their will. Fact. I like you, Serena. Nor we. A hundredfold stronger are they who choose to fight of their own accord. Bless him. Who is Jon Snow? Hien? Yeah. In some, in some aspects. He, he carries a little bit of Jon Snow energy. In certain... In certain... Areas. In his pride and truthfulness. Yes. Yeah. I love that about him. I think that's what makes Jon Snow such a good character, too. You know? Even when he fumbles. Who the... The Sarnex? It is. Ishtola is ready to put her skills to use. The will of the moon. It seems the time has come to put my skills to use. You got, I, ju I, ju I just read that. Pray lead the way to the house of the crooked coin. Alrighty. Ishtola could burn me alive. I agree. I love Ishtola so much. I want her to eat me. I want to be her litter box. I want her to be- I want to be her scratching post. Okay. The house of the crooked coins, so we just gotta go north.
I do love that it looks like Pepper is digging in her ass when she's trying to like whistle for her chocobo. <laughs> okay, let's see. Ooh, Moonrise. That's a pretty title. I like that. I like that name. Ooh. Moo shoo woo. Ooh woo. The ooh woo birds. Oh, it's over here. Not bad. Oh, ooh. I did not expect it to look like this. I kind of really like this. This looks very, like, future and pipey. I don't know. Let's see what he still has to say. Such an abundance of ether. Are we in luck? We are. This is an Allegan artifact, mm. most likely built to regulate the flow of ether. Mm. Okay. I strongly suspect the ancients used it to stem the flow from here to the burn. That would explain how they were able to untether what became Aziz La from its surroundings. But were we to throw open the floodgates, the resultant deluge would surely be sufficient to raise our wall. And in restoring the flow, we may also restore life to the wasteland. So it won't hmm. be all sandy and dusty and crusty and dead? What's going on? What's she thinking about? What is it? While the device itself harbors a surfeit of ether, the opposite is true of the surrounding area. An effect of regulation, perhaps. A similar phenomenon seemed to be occurring in Doma. Whatever the explanation, the answer will not reveal itself here. We have seen what we needed to see. Let us return to Mol Illo. What does she mean by that? What? So there's a lot of ether here, but not elsewhere? Is that what she means by that? I mean, I'm assuming I'll get more of an explanation early or later. Also, I don't even remember like what happened to her. Didn't like when she was brought back, something ha something happened. Like, she, like, lost her eyesight, or it's very weak now. And didn't she lose some of her, some of her echo? If not all of it? No, not all of it. Oh, I don't remember. I'm gonna need a, a, a refresher on that. You found that which you seek, then? Great. Great indeed is the Dusk Mother's power. If not less will suffice to protect our lands, the blessing of the other tribes must now be sought. Of course, but to which tribes should we appeal? There are many who worship the Ma, but none are so fervent in their faith as the Dotharl. Their consent shall be key. Shall be the key. I'll read in a second. Thank you, chap. The Dotharl. The, the Dotharl! We spoke of them. A warlike tribe possessed of unique customs and beliefs. I sense their cooperation will not be easily won. Nay, but it will be well worth the effort. The Dotharl fear nothing, death least of all, and our alliance will be greatly strengthened by their presence. Let us go to Jutharl Ka and treat with their Khatun or Khatun Sadu. Aren't I the Khatun? I guess I am the Khatun. Oh, she's so cute. She's so excited. She's so pumped. I love her. Um, <clears throat> She can see Eden now. It's how she sees. Oh. She said a sacrifice thing when she left the live stream. She's blind, but she used the spell technique to be able to see Ether. Never had the echo. Okay, so let's fly now and use Forbidden Man to see via ether, which is literally taking years off her life. Taking years off her life? She's using her life force to see ether? My baby? I'm scared now. I'm scared now. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready for what might come. 
If anything happens to my cat girl or my twinsies, I will riot. I will riot. I will find Yoshi P and I will scream and scream and scream and cry. Okay. This is a long, this is a long flight. How far do I have to go? Oh, I'm over here. I don't even have this attuned. Doro Elo, I'm assuming we're gonna be going there later. And it looks like there might be something south. Okay, I think I'm definitely unlocking like a dungeon. Like sock and shoe, sock and shoe, milk in the bowl f in the bowl before the cereal kind of psycho. Who the hell puts milk in the bowl first? I don't trust people that do that. Cause then like all the cereal will be on top. It won't like like settle properly. Wait, what's a bad translation? What's a bad what's a what's a bad translation? I've never ever addressed that in any form. Wait, I'm lost. Did I miss something, chat? What are y'all talking about? What what was the bad translation? Something about Ustola? You again. Little matters demand our time, Kagan. Or Hagan? Han? Han, right? Okay, well, well, that's not quite the opposite, in fact. Wait, so is she using her life force or not? Talking, always talking. Do the pillars hold great power? Of course they do. They're the source of Nama's strength. To the total, no place is more sacred, and we will make ash of any who would defile it. Though I see this is not your wish. No, it's not. We're good beings. You see the wisdom of a proposition, then? You will join hands with us? I said nothing of joining hands. You wish to wield Nama's power to defend these lands, and this I will allow. But for leaving the stuff to fight the men in iron, I would have something in return. Oh? What does this babe want? What does mommy Sadu want? Namely... Go on. Tell me. She's so toothy. Namely battle. With you, Han. Me? me? Yeah, me?! <laughs> When the dam ended, air began. I'd face you again, alone, without distractions. Girl, I don't want to fight you. Defeat me, prove yourself stronger, and you shall have the Tothal as your allies. Surely these are agreeable terms. I mean, I don't think I have a choice. Well, uh, this is a not wholly unexpected turn of events. Though I had assumed I would be the one required to fight. Alas, the Hatun has made her choice. Why me? Andy, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Welcome back for five months. Shall we dance? Hmm. I've ready my soul burns brighter. Prepare yourself on. And await me outside the ha. I will gather my witnesses and join you in none. Wait, we're fighting now? Now? I thought this would be after. Well, I mean, I'm not too mad about it. I just didn't expect it. She needs payment up front, literally. All right. Wait at the designated location. I am on my way. It's less that the transition is wrong and more that it can be read into multiple ways. Ether is one's life force, so she is spending it to see, but it also replenishes. So long as she's mindful, she should be okay. So my wife will not perish. Good. Thank you for the clarity. I needed that. Okay. Okay, chat. Let's go. It's gonna be a steamy hot battle, oh, please. <gasps> Mind the big guys. Okay, no one touch me. 
No one touch me. I'm cute. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. I'm cute. No! I said I'm cute! Don't touch me! Uh, go away. Go away, anal. Thank you. I know the battle music slaps, but I did not want that. Let's do this. I'm so glad I'm playing Dragoon, a class I am not good at. Okay, stare down. Yes! This spot shall serve as well as any. I shall enjoy this, Han. Mommy? Is this truly necessary? Have you no peaceable way of making decisions? What if I accidentally kill her? Speak not of peace! I guess I have to ask you her to yield. You stand before proud warriors of the Dathal. In the heat of battle do our souls burn brightest! We lay low the strong that we may rise higher! That is our way! The way of might! There is no other! Oh, they did not want for conviction. <laughs> Indeed, it's what makes them such dangerous enemies and such useful allies. What's the saying? Keep your enemies uh, enough talk. Close. It is time to fight. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer, or whatever. Right? Oh, that food! My tummy is rumbling. I made an error. I made a fucking error. Oh. Oh no. Alright, I still don't know how to play this boss, but you know what? You know what? You know what? Doesn't well, she have like cooler abilities than me? This is kind of unfair, isn't it? Oh. Yeah, she can do this shit! What do I do? Cry? Cry, bitch, and moan? Oh, she's, um. She's, uh. Is that. Was. No, that's, there's no way. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Oh, she's enraged? Oh. She's back? She has a buff? I miss that buff. What is her. Oh no! Oh oh god! Ah! Ah! I thought I was standing. Ah! Guys, I have to poop. I either have to poop or like I have to fart. Guys, this is not good. Fighting you is pure, pure bliss. Such sweet pleasure. Hello? She's powered up again? She's not done? Oh my god. And it went down to, to two. So I have to fire oh, hello? 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 Do I do I do I fight you guys too? Do I not? Do I? I don't I don't know. It looks like ah! Um, 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 um. What if what if fighting you has consequences? What if I'm not supposed to? Oh no, I think I already are you down? Not. Yes, you are. I don't know. I don't know. Who am I targeting? What am I, oh, I'm targeting? Sadu. Ah, I hate it here. 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 I hate. 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 There we go. I dude playing on a controller sometimes sucks ass. Y'all saw that, right? Y'all saw my hop bar there. What do you mean? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? <laughs> she seems so bratty. Why am I into it? I'm not normally into brats. I'm the brat. In death do our souls sing! Oh, oh, oh no. Do I do I take these down? I do, because we have to do that during that one battle thing, right? This is so unfair. I ain't summoning shit. I don't got anything to summon. This is so unfair. Oh, it's done. 
I'm dead. Oh god. Oh god. So am I. So am I. So am I. Can I stun that? No. Okay. That's on me. That's on me. Okay. It's almost dead. It's almost dead. It's almost dead. Okay. Where's Saru? Hello? 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 Abilities go off. Thank you. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? All I see are colors. Oh. My arms grow happy. My eyes dim. So long as my lifeblood flows, I'll fight on. What do you mean? You can do this too? Wait, how do I? What, wait, I can't. I can't focus it. I can't focus it. Why can't I focus it? What? Why can't I focus it? Why can't I focus it? I can't focus it. I, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What the heck? What is? What do you mean? What do you mean? No! No! Oh my God! Uh, mommy! Do I just focus her? Who do I focus? I'm gonna die! Yeah, 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 yeah. You like battling. You like fighting. It tickles your pickle. I get it. I heard it. I heard it. I know. I really want to reorganize my, my hot bar for um, this thing. The Dragoon. I forgot the name. Are my stuns working on her? No, they don't work on her. Oh, chat, my stomach. I'm getting the rumblies. I gotta poop so bad. Chat, I gotta poop. I should not have ordered Indian food. I knew I'd be gaming. I knew I'd be streaming this game tonight. I gotta poop. I gotta poop so bad. Chat, I gotta poop so bad. Chat, please. Free me. So I'm wondering, because like it wouldn't let me target the meteor, but I was able to target her. I'm wondering if I have to just kill her really quickly or maybe i have to kill the little guy that she spawns like these dudes <laughs> you know oh shit i fucked up i fucked up my rotation as if i know what it even is and that's my secret i don't i'm focusing her again somehow Okay. Chat, I gotta poop. 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 I'm old. Am I not doing any? Oh, I'm not doing any damage to these. Okay, okay, okay. In death to our soul sing. I wonder if I should save up. Oh no, no wrong ability. Oh, okay, I got it. That's why. In death do our soul sing! 
chat? Not chat. The hot bar? Hot bar! Hot bar! Hot bar! Thank you. Isn't there a cosplayer named Stella Chu? What's up, sir? Are you in this game? Are you actually just a big rock? Big stone? know what that ability does to be completely blunt okay, i'm not gonna use the other ability because it's gonna the cooldown's gonna like end by the time she dies okay 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 what phase is this Okay, okay. So I I don't I'm 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 spitballing here. I'm spitballing here. I'm gonna pretend I know what I'm doing. I'm gonna pretend I have an inkling. I don't! I do not! I don't know if I have to finish her off or if I have to kill the guys! Oh I fucked up my own Oh my god. I, I fucked up what I was gonna do. Oh my god, this is so bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. Oh, 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 this is so bad. Oh my god, I have so many regrets. I have so many regrets. I have so many regrets. I have so many regrets! I have so many regrets! Okay, 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 okay. Um, 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 no, 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 I don't know what I do there. I don't know what I do there. Do I feel like I could just finish her off? I just have to like hold my my cooldowns, get the crit up, time it properly. I don't know what to do there. I don't know what to do there. Mm. Wait, what happened? Predict with channel points? Hey yo, what were y'all doing? Yes. What this were y'all doing? Y'all thought I, I was gonna be her? Y'all bold. Y'all are bold. Is this truly necessary? Oh, 90k go to Vlad and two others? To the people who said no? <laughs> wow. I know, I know, I know how you guys really feel about me now. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm trying to like, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. What could I possibly do? Do I kill the guys? No, because they're just annoying. Does anything target it? Like the meteor thing? Oh wait, oh fuck, oh shit! Oh god! <laughs> turns into the dragon's eye thing. Like, how does that... I wish I could check right now, but I cannot. <laughs> it's a damage buff? Okay, good to know. Do our soul sing! 
Oh, my HP. I'm clinging to my life. I am, I'm, this is, I'm fucked. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. In death do our souls sing. I'm so fucked. This run is so bad. This run is so bad. I feel like I was doing great last time. Oh, I feel like I'm wasting that. No. No, I'm fine. I'm fine, right? Oh, I fucked up though. Oh, I should not have used it. It was a, da it was a damage buff, right? I should not have used it! I should not have used it! I should not have used it! I wasted it! Soiled it! Fuck, whatever. It's fine. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, wait. There's a buff still going. I still have a buff going. I think. I think that's me. That is me. Okay. 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 Wish me luck, chat. Wish me luck. Wish me luck. Wish me luck. I do not mean to restore my HP, but we ball, I guess. We ball, I guess. Okay, do I kill her? Are those is anything attached to that? No, it's just her. Okay. In death do our soul sing. <laughs> My HP. Oh, oh, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Get out of the air. We get it. Oh my god, I'm so dead. 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 I am so dead. I'm 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 so dead. I am not dead. I am not dead. I did it. I did it. I did it. Yes. Yes. Not since the Nardom has my soul burned so. There were doubters. There were non-believers. I'm a real gamer! I did it! Come! We have only just begun! Shit, my mic. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Enough! You were not Daddy. granted leave to set the step ablaze! Thanks, Daddy. <laughs> save Daddy saved me from mommy. <laughs> well, well, the sun has come out to play. Be gone, Moonstruck Oranir! I am busy! Did he stole his bang? Fool of a load? Can someone have you forgotten clip that? the face of your master already? Can the sun will that? never set he stole his from his seat face? on high. He reigns over all, now and forever. Dear Heart, thank you so much for the Prime sub. I appreciate it. And Vlad, thank you for gifting a uh, Druma sub. I appreciate it. Yet what should he find here but a battle to determine the fate of the step? A battle waged without his blessing. This will not stand. You, Doman! You who come to petition the warriors of this land, forget that all Nama's children are wards of the Oranir. As first among my brothers, your petition is mine alone to judge. Do not tell me I have to fight Daddy too. Do not. <sighs> These words are as wind from a horse's backside. Plentiful, but your act sings more sweetly. Let her speak for you. All right, so note to self. Uh, horses have crazy farts. <clears throat> There's no Insolent way. Excellent child. You will learn your place. Forgive me, Brother Magni, but we have an arrangement with the Dothal. We will not abide any interruptions. This is doing things. <laughs> so be it. The sun will pass judgment on all. Didacul, join me. is in good company. We may dance alone. Uh, 
again? Fear not for mercy, for you will have none. Bear witness to the power and the glory of Azim! Constantly at each other's throats like rabid dogs. God, I'm turning into her. Richard. <clears throat> I Rick have not chat. the patience for this. I got But if poop. we must fight, chat. let us at least be brief. Chat, Come. I gotta poop. I gotta poop. I gotta poop. I gotta poop. I can't hold it anymore. I can't hold it anymore. I held it for three, for three matches. I gotta poop.
Jin this whole time. Wow, I let Jin take the blow for that one. <laughs> or it was both of them? Well, that's even worse. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I'm I'm not gonna lie. I feel like I gotta go sit on that toilet a little longer. <laughs> I had the most uneventful poop. It was just the little guy. All of that rumbling for nothing. Why did I get Indian food? On the fucking, on the day that I'm playing Shadow, I'm about to try and play Shadowbringers. It was just the little guy. So, uh, excuse me, do not sniff me. So here's what I'm gonna do. Okay, chat. Here's the vibe, okay? I am... Um, I'm gonna hydrate. I'm gonna drink some water and some ginger ale. And I'm gonna... I'm gonna sit on my throne for like another like five or something minutes. Um, just cause like I want my stomach to settle because I don't want to be in another instance or whatever duty and then get booted out. Um, cause my stomach, girl, it does not feel good. It does not feel good. So I'll, I'll leave you here. Y'all can do what you want. And I will be, I will be right back. All right.
that our enemy has been vanquished. I'm alive! I did it! Thank you for being so patient with me. I know I was just gone for like 20 minutes, basically. Not the Bowel of Embers! But I did it. Thank you so much for being patient with me. I'm so, 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 so sorry. I'm still going, to, we're still gonna get to Shadowbringers, okay? It's just, we had to take a little bit of a detour, okay? I feel a lot better now. I have my ginger ale and I have my water, so I'll be good. At least I should be. Dropping the kids off. Yeah, no, it was the uh, the calamity, the eighth umbral umbral uh calamity. Hey Richie. Duty succeeded. <laughs> I completed my duty. Oh, I'm getting head pads! Oh, I'm getting head pads! You're wishing me a good job! Tell me I did good! Would you like to share some of my coffee? Um, no, I think my butthole has gone through enough trauma as it is. Because I never know what was happening when I watched, but I think watching enough. Going to finally give this game a try soon when it works well. <gasps> did we just get a converter? Did we just get a converter? Did we finally convert somebody else? Zombie, I'm so excited for you to try this game. This game is so fun. Benny, I see you in the chat. You are next. I know you're gonna be busy playing World of Warcraft, but um, sorry babes, you have to come and play Final Fantasy XIV with me so we can be really cute. Flash Drive, thank you so much for the Prime sub. I appreciate it. Except next time. Yes, that's what I actually meant. I meant next time. Okay, let me just fix my hair. Or my ears. Okay. It was a lot of reading, but had an amazing story worth the 600 hours, and that's a high bar. I agree. This game does have a lot of reading, um, but if you're super into, like, high fantasy and the like, you will love this. This game has so much drama, so much trauma. I love it. I fucking love it so much. I'm really glad that I bit the bullet and tried it out. I'm really glad I came back to it as well. All right. I think what's really nice about Final Fantasy XIV is there's something in it for everybody. Like, you like mining, you like cooking, you can do that in this game. You like just ridiculous lawless combat, well, this game's got that too. It's got a little bit of everything. It's nice. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm just like fixing my ears and then we'll get back into it. We'll get back into it. How did that poll go? <laughs> what ended up happening? I saw that y'all ran another poll and everyone was against me. Oh my god, jump puzzles. I will never be good at jump puzzles. Alright. The ears are on. The ears are earring. Okay. Chat said I wasn't gonna make it. The audacity. Okay. Ready? Who's ready? Okay. Here I go. Thank you, uh, Jin, for whispering um, that I pooped well. I appreciate it. Thank you. Hi, Kayla. You still traversed her fingers across Pepper's hills and valleys. Did you? Did you just write fanfic for me? Thank you. All right. Let's fucking do this again. I guess. All right. Y'all think I'm gonna be able to do this on my first go? I guess that could be my fourth. Oh, I used the wrong uh, combo. That's fine though. <laughs> oh, wrong thing happened. Get this out the way. Hopefully I can get back to it. I'm so sad that it fucking booted me. Oh, so frustrating. 
I didn't miss Saru. Oh, honey, you, uh, you did not. Saru's been here for quite a while. <laughs> what if I, can I hold on to that? In death do our soul sing. Is, it, is that worth holding on to? Is that something that I can hold on to? I guess not. It's kind of easy to get. Oh, that's already up. In death do our soul sing! I gotta prioritize what abilities I want to save for after the like the boulder thingies. Actually no, I don't need to kill these guys. I just gotta focus on her. They will make my life a living hell, but that's fine. Jay's in my life, so I'm used to that. Hello, game? <laughs> okay, and then the two thingy my boppers are gonna spawn like over here, right? Oh, I'm so wrong. Down, oh no, my HP though. My HP though, that's not looking too good. In death do our soul sing. I'm not supposed to take her down as well. Maybe I should use some of these not so stingy. I do feel like that was a bit of a waste though. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Oh my god, can I? No. I ran out of time. That's fine though. That's okay. I'll get it back. I think now it's the meteor, right? Came aside, unleashing your demons. Oh, but since it's getting late here, I hope you'll have a wonderful night. Bye! Take care! Oh. Yeah, I'm so sorry that um, our gameplay got distracted by my colossal shits. Come! But you know we what? We're better now, begun. and that's what matters, right? And that's what matters. Enough! You were not granted leave you know to set the here? step ablaze. I would skip the cutscene, but I don't know how much of it, like, I would have missed. It looked well, like it Well, well, the sun ending. has come out to play. Be gone, Moonstruck Oranir! I am busy! All right, so now the next fight is going to be me against Sadu and then Fool of these guys against Have you forgotten Kiana the face of your master already? Any Stola? The sun will never I could set! Just it. That's true, I could just do that. Yet you. All right. I 
I think it's getting closer to the Ishtola <laughs> voice line. I know there's a way to like speed with the D-pad. Yeah, like, child. like that. Right? But okay, so it doesn't actually speed the cutscene. That just speeds. Forgive me. That just speeds. That just speeds the, the, the boxes. So be it. Oh, it's only for not. Mm. Okay. I think we've caught up though. We're good. We made it! We made it! We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. We feel better, thank you. I definitely do. The sun is in okay. Let's see what's going on here. Beg not. All right, okay, it's here. Constantly at each other's. <clears throat> I am not the patience for this, but if we must fight, let us at least be brief. Come. I swear to God, if that was literally it, that was literally it. <laughs> that was literally it! Oh my God. All right, okay, let's see how this goes. Wait, defeat Magni? I'm fighting him? Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Okay, oh, why am I so close? Some more of this, huh? Okay, cure the sun down, that's a heal. Does she have a combo? Does she have a combo I should know about? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. His HP! He's got so much HP! This seems ridiculous! Oh, I gotta heal Kian. Wait, can I not? Can I not? I can. Bow down before me! What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay, okay. Here. Here. And then. And or 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 no or or no, um or no. Oh they oh my god they go down so fast. I thought it would take longer. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I accept the it. There. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Jesus. My dude, chill. Chill. It's kind of cool that they make us play as the other characters. I kind of like that. Kill or die. Please, please let me focus. Thank you. Oh, we got stung? What's that? Well Do you want me to get rid of that emote? Let me know. Let me know if the, this emote is too annoying. Oh, oh no, Kian, my boy. What the fuck is going on? Hero die. I am so glad I'm playing on a controller. I'm so glad I now have to go myself. Can you stop chasing me, please? I'm just a kitty cat. I am literally just a kitty cat. Bow down before I'm me. making like incredibly slow progress, which I will take. Mark well and learn. So can I just like get rid of one of those and then just chill here? Cause I'm not in the AOE now, so I should be good, right? I'm chilling. What does arrow even do? Does that put a status effect on him? What does that do? 
Die. Win damage over time. Neat. Okay, cool. Oh shit, he ends helping me now. Hell yeah. Bow down before me. Oh, Tremble that's so before much stronger. The They're so much stronger now. Oh my god. Get rid of the middle one at least. And then I'm good. No, fuck. Okay. Wait, what? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean to you? What do you mean to you? What? Is he gonna. Where, where am I going? Let us be about it. Is he gonna LB? What's he doing? Oh my god, he's limit breaking. Oh my god. Oh my god, he in. Oh. What? No, he's got me whipped. I know! What are you. Oh no! Oh no! Now fall! Oh no! Oh. Okay, 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 okay! I'm slamming! I'm slamming! I'm slamming! Oh fudge! I'm slamming! I'm slamming! Easy. Ethan, oh, that was sick! Me. Oh, this is sick! Oh, what's she doing? You. Oh. Did she go pew pew? Oh, that was fucking sick. That was fucking sick. That actually wasn't that bad. And y'all thought I was gonna lose? Y'all bet against me? Mm hmm. Never have I felt such bliss in defeat. She nut. Twas a battle to burn soul and flesh to ash. We doth all will lend you our strength as promised. Nama's power is yours to wield. What does the sun say to that? Neil, bitch. <laughs> the sun is not driven by base motives such as yours. But I, they have been judged and found worthy. Yeah. It is the way of the Oranir to accord recognition and respect to the strong. You have made sufficient proof of your strength. The sun shall answer your call. I did the thing. I'm a god. You have our thanks. We are glad to call you allies. Thardex, that is a spoiler. You just you you just baited me. You, and that could have been true. By what are you called? What was that what was that thing we talked about? Come on. Come on, Sarnix. Come on. You stole her. Why? Are you? Is she? Are you her? my Nama? What? I beg your pardon? Does he just flirt with everybody? I mean, I'm down bad too, In battle, bro. you shone with all the majesty of the full moon's light. Your healing touch, the embodiment of the Dusk Mother's love. Oh. Long had I wondered if my Nama might not be a woman of the steppe. Beholding you, I am all but certain. He likes the lady that could beat his ass, and you know what? Same. Now, look into my eyes. <laughs> could it be? Could you be? I am 
Not interested, little son. Try again when you've become a man. Oh! My! Little? enough time here. Siren awaits for word of our success. Why am I obsessed? This is hilarious. This is so funny. Well, she could be my Nama. My head's up on club. I'm sorry my poop delayed the scene. <laughs> oh, that's fucking funny. You had not only to contend uh, with Sadu, but Magni too? Such a fierce battle that must have been. Yet here you stand, triumphant. Having passed such a test, they could not well deny you their allegiance. The mole will make no such demands. Weak though we are, we will gladly, we will gladly stand with you. The step is our home and we will defend it with all our being. You have my heartful thanks. Of all the tribes of the steppe, there is none I would rather have at my side. God's willing, many more will rally to our cause. I shall send you word when we have answers from all the tribes. I cannot thank you enough, Serena. None of this would have been possible without you. Oh, She's so stinking cute! Oh, alrighty! It edged us real good! <laughs> good! Oh, good night, dentist! Take care! Oh, Angie face. Your soul would see the ether flow once more. We have the requ requisite consent. Tis time to put Nama's power to use. If the ether flows as planned, all that remains is to have the ironworks engineers do their work at the ruins. Come, let us return to the house of the crooked coin. All right, it sounds good, babes. Oh, a waving at Serena? Yeah. God, that was so funny. That was so fucking funny. I'm gonna use that the next time someone flirts with me. Hit me up when you become a real man. It was worth it for the moment? Good. Good. I think so too. I think so too. That was a worthy prize for my big shit. Alrighty. Cutscene? I shall begin at once. You may wish to step back. Give me the cutscene. Give me the cutscene. Okay, we are staring, we are looking. Oh, she's readying. She's readying. She's doing the thing. I don't know what she's doing, but she's doing it and she's doing it well and she's cute, so I care immensely. Oh, it's jiggling? It's 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 jiggling. Why is it jiggling? Is it gonna burst? Is it gonna crumble? Is this whole place gonna fucking rum? Booty cheeks! <laughs> it's ascending! I think? No. Nope, it just went foom. Oh, she's spent. I did not like that animation from that angle! <laughs> did it work? It did. Ether may flow freely to the burn once Ooh! more. She did the thing! So that means life in the burn was restored then and what have you? Right? There was a reason why we did that, right? 
don't rem I don't remember. I'm ashamed to admit that. Let's do this again. Okay. I do not pretend to understand what you did, you stole it, but you did it! Thanks to you, Pepper. Thanks to you and Pepper, of course, we have taken a momentous step towards securing our defenses. What do they want to do with this again? Now, as much as I believe the rest is in order, we should probably make haste back to the Enclave. How do they want to do that again? The others may have already returned from their missions. I would like to know how things stand. As would I. Without further further ado, then. Literally, that shit took everything out of me. They needed energy to power the thing they found in the- oh, Right! Yes! Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So now where is- Okay, the Domen Enclave. Right? Yes. Speak with Alize and Kian Khan, which is that. Okay, perfect! We're making some progress. We're making some progress. I still probably have nine more quests to go, but I'm not going to bed until I'm done. <laughs> Yan doesn't even know why you did that. Don't kill me. They should put a password on this thing, or any old powerful capital archon could come here and log in. You're so right. Authentication codes, you know. Lord Yan is expecting you. May I show you in? Yes. Y'all, my like the rest of my Indian food is beside me. Do I do it? Do I eat more? <laughs> so tempted. Judging by your triumphant expressions, I take it all went well on the Azim step? Indeed, we have secured a suitable source of energy for the barrier. That's the barrier. Good. Tataru and I have commissioned Garland Ironworks to ensure that the fuel generators function as they should. A team of engineers stand ready to set up for the burn at a moment's notice. If you'd only say the word, I thank you for engaging their services on our behalf. The... Minute? The, the mine... Minute? Whatever. Of the arrangement you should leave to me. I know that word, I just can't say it. Which just leaves the small matter of our alliance. So, Yugiri and Hakuro, how fared you with our neighbors? My lord, all of the factions we approach are in- I'm not doing my accent! Uh, all, the, all of the factions we approach are in agreement that the Empire poses a threat, and many responded positively to talk of an alliance. From Hingashi and Sui no Sato, however, we received outright rejections. The former will not break its treaty with the Empire, and the latter will not involve itself in conflict. Just as we expected, then. Well, there is not to be done about it. We must focus on the rest. To each of the nations that were amenable to an to not alliance? Oh my god. I will personally send a missive. And once I have attended to that, I believe we will have done everything we can to fortify Doma's defenses. For the time being, at least. All of which I means I'm all of which means I may leave for the meeting in Alamigo with a lighter heart. Yugiri, Hakuro, if you would be so kind as to hold the fort in my absence. My friends, you could not have achieved so much in so little time without your help. For that, I give you my heartfelt thanks. Till the meeting, then. Mm. I do a little. Mm. I took the liberty of asking Thancred to attend as well. He should have arrived in the Alamegan quarter by now. And then let us not keep him waiting, shall we? Oh, was that Ali say that said that? It was. My bad. I fucked up her accent. I didn't use one. I feel so bad. Okay. The Alamegan Quarter, so now I gotta go here? No, here, Girabanya, yes. So dumb, okay. And that is here? Isn't it? No, that's Rogers. Isn't it down here? Isn't it somewhere over here? Yeah, there it is. I hope I get to see Alamigo like look a little bit nicer because it is a bitch to get around. How active is the FC? Because I'm thinking of transferring my main to NA. I would say. I would say it's pretty active. We play a lot, so. I think, I think it's worth it, Amy. I'm just saying. There are cute cat girls in there. You could be another one. <laughs> okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. All the way over here. This way past the drunk. Oh, the drunk is not there. Oh, I'm, I went a different way this time. Oh, I'm speaking with Thancred? Okay. 
Yisrael has told me all, and I duly told Uriange and Cryo. Cryo in particular was concerned about Alfino, but I assured her that everything that can be done is being done. She agreed to continue with her own tasks for the, for the time being, on the condition that I contact her at the moment there is any development. So it leaves four of us to attend the council. Aaron Vold is here to assist with security, incidentally. Though, the poor lad seems altogether too distracted for the task. Another one missing Alfino, I expect. Ah, uh, but it's almost time. As soon as you're ready, present yourself to the guardsmen at the, pa at the palace entrance. I shan't be far behind. So when is he getting a shave? Ooh! I'm so glad I shat! I'm so glad I pooped! Look at the Final Fantasy XIV channel for something cute. Okay. It better be a picture of me. That's really fucking cute. That's very cute. Y'all having a little cult meeting? Very cute. But I'm not in there. Alright. When find a got a dang when when find a got oh when we find a razor okay <laughs> okay it's cutscene time I think it's the end of four point four oh thank God okay are we ready shot are y'all ready I am I got my poop out I have my water I have my gingy I really love my. JP, my Japanese FC? I'm not active anymore, so I'd love to be a part of the coven. Yes! Oh my god, please. Because a lot of us are, like, still new to the game, you are going to be stuck with a lot of a lot of players who are consistently playing, but maybe a little bit behind. But that's okay. Am I ready? I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready. Okay, here we go. I really want to eat more Indian food, but I will shit my brains out, so I think. Mistress Lees, Commander Aldin, it gives me great pleasure to formally welcome the city state of Alamigo to the Eorzean Alliance. Purplip. The pleasure is ours, Your Grace. I know I speak for all Alamegans when I say that we are glad of this chance to stand with our comrades of the Alliance. And we for our part are glad indeed to be able to welcome friends both old and new. I still love her design, like the Elder Seed Seer or whatever. Lord Hien of Dorma, at your service. Pray, accept my heartfelt thanks for your generous invitation. Nay. It is we who must thank you for journeying so far. And would be remiss boy. of me not to acknowledge the part the Scions of the Seventh Dawn have played in bringing all of us together. Sweet boy. In times of great unrest, you and yours have been our constant companions, without whom we would not be here. I can't stop looking at her titties. I got some nice titties in With game. apologies to Lord Hien and Mistress Alize, it occurs to me that we have not gathered in this way since that fateful day in Uldar. What a throwback. The day I lost my arm and my freedom. As I lay in my cell, never did I dream that I would one day be given the chance to represent my homeland at this council. I would not even be alive had you not plucked me from the jaws of death. You, Yugiri, and Alfino. Would that the lad could be with us. I hope he's okay. I too owe my presence here to Alfino. In so many ways. Until such time as he returns, I mean to carry on his good okay. work as best I, I really can. I really hope he's okay. Come, friends. Let head. us leave the past in the past and turn our eyes to the future. My lord Hian, pray, tell us how things stand in the east. <sighs> Sorry, I don't mean to yawn.
Having heard the rumors of dissent in Garlemald, I dared to dream of a peaceable solution. Hmm. <laughs> the Empire will not so easily change its ways. Mommy! If the Garleans have a mind to take back Doma and Alamigo, we'll be hard-pressed to stop them, even with the might of Six Nations. She looks so much like a lion. Like, but while we lack the strength to fight the tide, I a course may yet like present friend, itself, like if we read the winds aright. The winds suggest but one course to me. One which leads from the sea unto the river and thence to the source of all our woes. The Asians. Indeed. All here have felt their blighted touch. It was the bringers of chaos who nurtured the Archbishop's tyrannical ambitions. They who bestowed upon him the secrets of summoning, as they have so many others before and since. And while they remain, we shall know no peace. Just remember now. Our objective is clear. The question is how to achieve it. That our enemy parades about in Xenos's skin poses problems in itself, but ere we get to them. How are we to infiltrate the Empire and get close enough to strike? That's a good question. I guess it lies in Alfino's hands, like... While I see the wisdom in targeting the Asians, an assassination attempt on Garlean soil would do little to aid our cause, even were it to succeed. It's time we used our enemy's preferred tactic, subterfuge. You have an idea? Speak your mind, Master Thancred. None here know the enemy better than the Scions, and you may have best of all. Whatever it is you propose, we will give it fair hearing. On that you have my word. Very well, Admiral. My proposal is thus. Say this. We dispatch the Shinobi to Imperial territory. There, they sow the rumor that the Crown Prince perished in the battle for Alamigo, and that the man parading around is in fact a corpse inhabited by a servant of darkness. Well, it does have the ring of truth about it, and were the Garleans to learn that their future ruler is a puppet, the Empire would be shaken to the core. But, at the risk of sounding stupid, would they actually believe such an unlikely story? At I didn't. Sounding stupid. Ordinarily not. But prior to his miraculous recovery, rumors of Xenos' death had already begun to circulate around the Empire. Ultimately, however, what the masses believe is not our chief concern. Our true objective is to create an opening for rival factions within Garlemald to exploit. Just as a war of succession erupted in the wake of Empress Solus's death. I can't not read that or hear that a as war like, which Solus. raged until but recently. Like, from Dragon plunging Age? the Imperial <laughs> House into disarray as nephew and uncle grappled for the throne. Uncle it is no coincidence that one of Varus's first acts as Emperor was to name Xenos heir apparent, family feuds being so tiresome when armies are involved. Not all welcomed his choice of successor, however. There is no shortage of individuals who aspire to the throne, who would jump at any chance to seize power. The news that Xenos is not only dead, but a puppet to diabolical forces, would be too enticing to ignore. That's true. The it's Empire would not be quick to recover from a second war of succession. I am no stranger to infiltrating Imperial territory. With a team of operatives gathered from among the Alliance's finest, the plan should have a reasonable chance of success. Dorma already has Shinobi in place throughout the provinces. We stand ready to act, and act we must. What say you all? I'm for Master Thankry's proposal. Yee. We shine a light upon the Asian and test the Empire's unity. Make him crumble. 
Twas his plot that scuttled Doma's negotiations, was it not? Why then, if we can eliminate him, there may yet be a chance for peace. Let us wage this war of subterfuge that we may one day lay down our arms. Gods know we never will while the Assians remain. Look at my knockers! Oh shit! Oh my god! I was just trying to look at my tits! That way. Sorrow. I'm getting punished for looking at my own boobs! Where am I? History must be changed. Yeah, who, who this? Ahead looms a calamity. Ahead looms light, expunging all form and life. Is this, this kind of sounds like Twin the barrier Twin dooms, darkness? only you can forestall. Only you. Is it him? What's no. the matter? Oh, oh! Oh shit! This. There's oh. a voice! Oh, they're getting it too. Spies in our midst! Nay, I sense no such presence. Who is it? What is this? Let expanse contract. Eon become instant. Throw wide the gates that we may pass. my temples like I'm in pain <laughs> so all the scions got that look at each stole his eyes She's like, is it fuck? over <gasps> oh. master Thancred oh twelve for fend he's n Bear him to a private chamber. Have every healer make ready. Swiftly. Oh, we just got him back. What do you mean? What do you mean? Uh, man lost an eye. His hair grew. He's got a beard. Let him rest. Master Thancred remains in slumber. Though his vital signs appear stable, he's unresponsive. I will accept that. What could have done this? And, and why just him and not the others? I'm afraid we could not identify the cause, my lady. Our examinations revealed no wounds, nor the presence of any poisonous substances. Substances, yeah. God, that only makes it worse. You're to let us know the moment there's any change, all right? Thank you for coming. Knowing Thancred, he would apologize for being otherwise engaged at so crucial a juncture. We lost Thancred because I just want to look. I just wanted to look at my boobs. In gifting us a course of action, Thancred sowed the seed of all that is to follow. We have but to nurture it as best we can. To him, I would say, rest easy, that he may wake to enjoy the fruits of our labors. Enjoy the fruits of my labors. Now, the matter of the mysterious voice must not be forgotten. Will you tell me exactly what happened? Girl. Alizé and I heard a voice in the moments before Thancred collapsed. It was accompanied by a severe headache, as if something were clutching at our minds. Did you experience the same thing? So, in between the voice and the pain, you felt as if you were somewhere else entirely? I was walking in the abyss! <gasps> I was walking in the shadows. <laughs> Your testimony <laughs> confirms my suspicion. That which you experienced was, I believe, your soul being plucked from your flesh. Called. 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 I myself examined Thancred. Reach out as I may. 
I could not sense in him the spark of life that is his soul. He's gone? That Thancred alone was stricken so is likely due to his heightened sensitivity to the effects of ether. A consequence of his prior possession by the Asian Lahabrea. Breadman. The owner of the voice, whoever it may be, reached out to you, called your souls, and in so doing, caused you and yours such pain. So whoever's trying to communicate but with me is causing me pain. If that's true, where exactly are we being Accidental? called to? I know not. Yet one thing is plain. Whoever waits for you on the other side is possessed of a power unlike any I have ever known. It's me. Forgive us, Lise, but may we leave Thancred in your care for a time. As if you had to ask. I may not be a scion anymore, but I'm no less a friend. Don't worry. I'll see to it that Thancred's well looked after. Just focus on solving this mystery, all right? Got it, babes. Thank you, Lise. As the Elder Seed Seer says, tis no ordinary individual we are dealing with. Nor can we discount the possibility of Asian involvement. Is it an Asian trying to speak with us? Whoever or whatever is behind this, the sooner we find out, the better. This plot advancement is so good. Like, I love that it's now just like boom, 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 boom. You know? Shit after shit after shit after shit. Can we get the clip of Sara smiling at least? No, it never happened. It never, it never, no, no, you have no evidence. There is no evidence of me smiling at least. No, no. Her cow necklace? <laughs> it's an upside down cow. <laughs> I said nothing. I did nothing. You're all liars. Okay. I just tried to call Rionje on his link pearl. He didn't respond. Oh, sorry. He didn't respond, but I dare to hope that he possesses some knowledge we do not. Oh. Her face is kind of buried in my- okay. Ah, oh, Rianje, something happened during the meeting. Thancred's collapse, a disembodied voice suddenly started. Did he feel it too? What? But that's- You should talk about this in person. Alright, we'll meet you there. That was Rianje. He heard the voice too- Aha! In Thanala- So, uh, did they call out to all the Scions? I would say all the people who have like the, the Echo or something, but you, you all said that Ishtola doesn't have that. As we alone reflected at the meeting, I have my suspicions, but if the voice also spoke to Uriange, there can be little doubt the science were targeted. Well, well. By whom and to what end is the question? One to which we must find an answer with all possible haste. Let me get into my character voices. <laughs> oh, I got an angry face in duel. I wanna try it. I wanna try it. Do I look cute? Is it like a constipation face? Can I see it? Let's see. <laughs> Yeah, pooping. I do a poop. Uh, glamour plate. Let me pick something else. Uh, this one? Do you guys, do you guys like my reaper outfit? <laughs> Get it? Because I have a scythe. Oh, I, um, I don't hear, but I normally do. <laughs> um, should I wear my winter fit? No. My Starbucks fit? My Princess Jasmine fit? No, we're gonna wear this one for now, I think. It's cute. I hate my dragoon fit. All right, are we in? Are we in four point five now? How is they can only get a signal with their face and Pepper's head exactly? After this one, hell yeah, Alize is eager to rendezvous with Rionje. Rionje agreed to meet us at the Rising Stones. If any of the others heard the voice, we'll find out soon enough. Good luck. I should get back to the meeting with the Elder Seeds here. But if there's anything I can do, anything at all, you must let me know, alright? Promise me. Ooh. Right, let's be on our way. Oh. Oh. 
jumping into a cutscene already. All right. Bye, Grits. God, They're it's so good cute. to see you. Would that our meeting were under happier circumstances. I judged the voice sufficient cause for concern even before you sent word of its effect on our comrade. Oh, the mysterious music. While you I'm heard in it my too, then. <laughs> Excuse me. I. And all but certainly at the self-same instant. Alas, pained as I was, I could make little sense of what few words did then reach mm. mine ears. Who do you think is responsible? Could this be the Asians doing? That I cannot say. Not when so little is known. Ere I indulge in speculation, I would examine Thancred with mine own eyes. Can we see your eyes? Now? To Alamigo, then. Without further delay. We just got here. Why didn't he just meet us there? Are you One other thing. Kidding? Oh. During my visit to the Far East, I observed a strange phenomenon. Thou referrest, I presume, to the localized reduction in etheric density. Well, that spares me the trouble of an explanation. Yes, I noted precisely that at two apparently unconnected locations. I take it the phenomenon is not limited to the Far East. Indeed not. Of late, our agents charged with surveilling the beast tribes have spoken of little else. In every corner of the realm, they tell of places in which the ether hath grown thin. Naturally, my suspicions first turned to primal activity, but the areas thus affected betray no evidence of summoning. I must confess to being quite perplexed. If the same phenomenon is being observed in multiple locations on opposite sides of the world, we may safely discount regional factors. Needless to say, this warrants further investigation. Is the world just losing its magic? Indeed. Like... I shall make it my task to... Oh! The voice. It calleth to me once more. Not the inverted cutscenes and flashes. Oh shit! I I hear it too. Us next. Boom boom. Yep. <laughs> Only you. Only you. Only me? <sighs> no! This is a bad trip. Oh, well, we're it's in our like drinks. Real Jay. What about me? Throw wide the gates. I can widen my gates. Oh, mysterious no. voice. No, this can't be happening! What happened to Orianger? Is he dead? <gasps> Yishtola! Orianger! Open your eyes! Open your eyes, I beg you! Say something! Anything! Oh, poor Alize. Please, not again. Oh, poor Alize. She has not known peace. I literally just got you guys back. Why am I okay? Why am I fine? Take me instead. Not my other cat girl, please. That's my wife. Oh, 
Forgive me, that was an unseemly display. No, girl, you do not need to apologize for that! Uh, it happened before your eyes, my lady. None here would have be 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 behaved any differently. We have borne the two of them to a private chamber. But tell me, is it true that Master Thancred languishes in a, like in a like state in Alamigo? I'm afraid so. Though, given the circumstances, it would seem best to observe them together. It was in words at least that he should be brought here. Take heart, my lady. The world is full of scholars and knowledgeable folk of every persuasion. Someone out there is bound to know whales, our comrades, and how it may be cured. Thus we will ruse, ruse them? Rouse them, no matter what. That we will, Ori. Hori. Hor, 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 hor. That we will. But first things first, our comrades will have questions. May I ask that you explain the situation to them? I must attend to a private matter. What's the private matter? Oh, I promised I'd visit someone in Limsa Liminsa. He's been waiting at Maelstrom Command for a while now. You know, you should come along too. I think he'd be glad to see you. Sid? The guy who... Rode the ship? Piloted the ship? Flown, f uh, sank the ship, the, the ship. Who could that be? In Limsa Laminsa? Prelude and Violet. And Violet. Who's purple? I only know the Sylphs. Okay. Who's there? I hope I don't see them. I hope it's going to be dramatic. What if it's someone I don't even care about? What if it's somebody I don't even remember? Knowing me, I'm not going to remember who they are. Alright, hi Alize. As you probably guessed, it's Gabu. Gabu? Gabu! The baby? The little guy? The private here will bring him out to us? Is that the baby? Ever since the maelstrom took him in, I've tried to visit as often as I can, and after what befell our friends, I was taken by the urge to visit again. It's difficult to explain. Oh my god, the baby! The baby boo! The gobble baby gooby zooby! Oh, the baby! With the baby, show me the baby. Show me the child. <laughs> How's he doing? Here he is, my lady. Gabu, it's been too long. Is he still not talking? I'm afraid there's been no change. If he can see or hear us, he has given no sign. I see. You're still fighting. I'm proud of you. <laughs> we promised that we would come and visit you together, didn't we? Alphano and I. I'm sorry that we haven't managed that yet. You know, with the three of us like this, does it not remind you of that night? Of the stars beyond count twinkling in the heavens. I was feeling pretty low back then. Powerless. But I knew that my brother was close by if I needed him, and that the others would be waiting for me back at the Rising Stones. Not like now. I've seen my share of trouble since coming to Eorzea. Been reminded again and again of my limitations, of how little I can change about this world. And I've come to know the sorrow of parting all too well. Is 
But to have the people I hold dear struck down before my eyes and be powerless to help them, that, that I cannot bear. You still have me? You don't have to bear this burden alone? I think I'll say you still have me. And for that, I am grateful. I don't know what I would do without you. <laughs> well, that's more than enough brooding for one day. Wait, I want to spend more Come time on. with Gabu. We have friends to save. What about Gabu? I want to give him a hug. Oh. I dropped my, my, my tissues. I'm gonna grab with my feet. <laughs> I forgot about Gabu. I forgot about the little baby. His story was so sad. Oh, uh, what, where, where did we meet him again? Was it in Heaven's Ward or like, Post heaven's word or something. <sighs> Post heaven's word, yeah. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> Let's return to the Rising Stones and take you from there. Thanks again for agreeing to come. It meant a lot to me. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm really glad that I came. Is that a is that a bunny boy? I oh, know it's a bunny girl. I think actually I don't know, but they're cute. Okay. Ugh. That got me. That really got me. A bunny day, if you will. And I will. And I will. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. Alright. I guess there's a cutscene waiting for me in here, maybe. Oh, I finished the- Oh, does that mean we're in 4.5 now? I did some thinking on the way back, and I think Hori is right. We need to seek outside help. Ordinarily, we would turn to our own experts on such matters, but they're both among the stricken. I'll begin by reaching out to the myriad guilds and research institutions here in Eorzea. Additionally, Grandfather and Philia had a wealth of connections between them, and I mean to explore those avenues, of avenues too. We'll find a way to save everyone, mark my words. Much and more has happened in recent days. Some of it for the good, some not so. But all around me, people continue their fight. From the shinobi who search for Alfino to the alliance who's who mem me the alliance members who make ready to move against their empire, they march on in the face of great adversity, bearing heavy burdens. Everyone is playing their part, and so must I. You have your own part to play, you know, and it's bigger than most, so I won't keep you. Just promise that you'll visit from time to time, and I promise I'll have good tidings to share with you when you do. I have seven more quests. That's it. That seems that seems so doable. <sighs> Meanwhile, in the Empire Palace. Oh, please be elf, you know. I need some good news. I need something. We know they wouldn't be in the palace yet.
Ashley Tisdale and her goddamn dumpy. The Populares no longer present an obstacle. Now is the time to bring the Empire's might to bear. Does he know that that's like not his son? A word from your radiance is all it takes. But one word, and the Imperial army will fall upon Alamigo as a pack of bloodthirsty wolves and tear that feeble nation apart. Have you no words for me? Despite the lengths I go to, an emissary playing the part of a fool. Okay, so he... When first I took this face, I swore to use all of my knowledge, all of my power, to further the cause of the Empire. Yeah, so he knows. My deeds stand testament to my commitment. And with this adamant flesh at my disposal, this, I could destroy the Icon Slayer as easily as one might swat a fly. Why do you hesitate? <sighs> Our enemy is resourceful. Though victory is certain now, it will not remain so indefinitely. Deliberate if you must, but be quick about it. We'll speak again when you have unburdened yourself of doubt. Until then, I take my leave. Father. God, the armor is so ridiculously bulky. <laughs> I should be the one to sigh. I played my part to perfection. I had earned my rest, and then, thanks to La Habrea's crowning act of idiocy, our favorite emissary sees fit to summon oh, me this? back. Oh, I, I know who this is. I know who this is. I know who this Elidibus is. Elidibus was ever a warrior. A most tiresome <laughs> trait, would you not agree? I've seen artwork of this guy's dick. <laughs> That's it! But who is he? What? Have you no words for me either? No matter. I've long grown weary of this mummery. Yeah, I've seen your dick on Twitter. I now, don't know you, but I know you cock. Now, my grandson, let me remind you of your place in the simplest of terms. You do not make judgments. You administer them. Swiftly and to the letter. Naught else is your concern. Elidibus may be an insufferable bore, but he is no fool. His choices as emissary seldom err. You tell me I saw a grandpa dick on my timeline? If aught threatens the balance twixt light and dark, it falls to you to remove it. Be it by your own hands or by your armies, you have ample means at your disposal. How old do Garleans live for? That is why this empire exists, why I built it! <gasps> You're soulless! Oh dear, have I touched a nerve? You always were an easy one to read. I pity I'm you. I'm so confused. I do. As they say, ignorance is 
bliss. I'm so confused. And I know how much happier you would be not knowing the things you know. I'm so confused. The founding father was an Asian, and he created the empire solely for the purpose of sowing the seeds of chaos. Don't take it personally. I merely do my duty. Is my name duty? Someone check my uh, my ID. To real bring quick. about a calamity requires no small amount of power, and there is no surer way to obtain such power than by collecting powerful pawns. To that end. I have labored long and hard, and I must say I am quite pleased with my handiwork. Paltry though it seems in long, comparison to hard, Alec. Pleased handiwork? <laughs> well! 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 I saw things are over fond of your own voices. I saw your dick for nothing. Mark you had three minutes. Man is the master of his own. You had destiny. three minutes of screen time. And I saw your dick a hundred times on my timeline. Such a waste of time and energy, both yours and mine. The dick prevails. His cock will not be conquered so easily. Lest you forget you are emperor now. If you wish to spout drivel about man's destiny, save it for the masses. It will serve to give them a sense of purpose and you Client pieces for the game. Oh, do stop sulking, boy. You of all people should understand. This collar looks like a gag Ours ball. Ours is a struggle to restore both mankind and the world Sorry, to their I don't know rightful why that's state. What I'm focusing View on. thus, our goals are one and the same. Like, you could just, like, hike it up and, ah, you know? So... Are you stepping on me? So, he's... Is he the voice that I was hearing in my head? No. Wait, so he's a grandpa? And he's also a great-grandpa. How the fuck is he alive? How long do Garleans live for? No, but he said he's an Asian. I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. I don't know. Does he want to use that gag ball later, though? Uh, hmm. Oh, Alfie, no! What in the world? I just, I just, ah, my boy! What are you looking at? Oh. Oh. What are we looking at? Who are these people? Their outfits are blue. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. Dead. All dead. Yet I see no wounds, nor any evidence of battle. Oh my god, that's terrifying. They just get their life sucked out of them? Damn them. They finally used it. Used what? The Empire developed an alchemical weapon in Girabanya, a gas 
Black Rose, it was called, and to breathe it is to breathe your last. And that did this. But the, pr the project abandoned and its vile fruit destroyed. But not else could have wrought such an atrocity. Fools. What do they hope to gain with this butchery? Do they not see that a rule won through terror will not endure? How many more provinces must they lose? Ooh, the music is getting spooky. Nay, wait. This is not the work of men, but monsters. The Asians. It cannot be a coincidence that their trial that their trail led us here. Their objective was never to rule, but to sow strife and discord. Hey, I use Discord too. Keep in touch. <laughs> it's a bad joke, I'm so sorry. Not a time for joking. Such a crime does indeed bear the mark of the bringers of chaos. Black Rose cannot be allowed to kill again. We must find the Asians to put an end to the plot. Is he just me? Is it just me or like, is he really hot? He's really hot, right? Right? Oh, this music? I'm so synthy. A history of Violet. So we're in um so we're in uh, 4.5 now? You guys said there's like seven quests left? It's 1 a.m. I can do it, right? That shouldn't take too long. Sort of blew up when they did a face reveal on that guy. Okay, good. 4.5 is a short boy. A short boy? Three hours of stuff left. Shouldn't unless you poop again. All right, who is down? Uh, yeah, my my. <laughs> no spoilers. Do not eat Indian food while streaming. <laughs> um. Okay, so are y'all down to to sit with me until we until we get through it, or at least as much as I can get through? I have to go to bed. I'm sorry, Edible Mon. Good night. Oh. <sighs> I'll get through, like, as much as I can. Doesn't go too long? Okay. Alright. God, I can't believe they gave me Gabu, made me sob over him, and then threw an old man at me. A hot old man. I don't- Okay, I don't understand, and chat, I don't want you to answer this. This is just me, like, asking questions out loud into the ether, if you will. Um. Why is- How- I thought he was dead? They spoke about him like he was dead? Isn't- But then- But then he- I think he said he was an Asian. I think he like hinted at that or like flat out said it? Or is it like an Asian like in his body? I don't- I don't fucking know. I don't know. And his grandson looked just as- Well, actually he didn't look like anything, but I'm confused. I'm super confused. I don't know. I couldn't really follow along. I kept thinking of all the artwork that I've seen his dick in. Because <laughs> he said... No, I don't want you to say anything, Jay. I'll, pe I'll piece it together. Don't, don't tell me anything. Because um, he said, like, he created the Empire. Like, Solus created the Empire. Oh, God. Souls created the, the elven. Oh my god. Anyways, he created the empire um, to rule and sow chaos or his seed, if you will. Um, and then he said, an Asian ruled the empire or whatever. So I think that means he's an Asian. I, I don't know. Alize is at her wit's end. Why did I say that in the fucking. I'm glad you've come, though I'm afraid there's little in the way of good news. 
You're supposed to After be confused? You left, okay. We reached out to both the Alchemist Guild and Stillglade Fane and attempted all manner of treatments. Yeah, I'll just I'll figure it out as it goes. I don't I don't want a reminder. But the results were always the same. The game will tell me. Whatever the answer <laughs> is, it's not alchemy or conjuring. If I change my mind though, I'll ask I'll ask y'all like actual questions that need answers. Why did it have to be Yishtola and Urianger and not me? Oh, babe. Out of all of us, they are the ones who could feasibly have solved this puzzle. Oh, puppy. And Elfano's still missing. God, it's all going wrong. Oh, Where do we even start? A grave situation indeed. Might I be of some assistance? Oh! My sweet baboo. Crime. I did not think you well enough to travel. Hello, sweet baboo. When word reached me of the plight of our friends, I could not well stay away. As a fellow scion, not to mention your erstwhile mentor, this is one of those times you should feel free to call on me, regardless of my personal circumstances. I love her. I, yes, I should have thought of that. Thank you for coming, Kryle. We would welcome your insight. And I should be happy to provide it. Now, what's this I hear about Alphano heading into Imperial territory? That boy always did have some funny ideas. Do you remember the speech he gave when he was accepted to the studium? You sure? My life's goal is not less than the salvation of this star. Corny. <laughs> Pepper's just like well, that particular blank. grand pronouncement has been a source of great embarrassment to him, as you know. But the fact of the matter is, he meant every word and has lived his life accordingly. Yes, he remains altruistic to a fault, but I'm worried he was too fixated on his goals to see the dangers, as has happened before. No, but he's grown from that. It was a learning he curve. He needn't be so concerned. Though his values remain the same, Alphano is not the blinkered boy he once was. Slowly but surely, his eyes have been opened. Thanks to a certain someone. Don't give me credit. Don't give me credit. A certain someone whom he'd be mortified to learn had heard about his little speech. Mum's the word, eh? Right, I'd better have a look at our patients. They're in the infirmary, I assume. I'll need absolute quiet, so it would be best if I did this alone. If you'll excuse me. I love the way Lalafell walk. They're so freaking cute. Hey, Brave. Hello. Kyle has big, your favorite teacher energy. Yes, she absolutely does. I agree. All three are in fine physical health. At a glance, I would say they were merely sound asleep. Okay. Except for the fact that I couldn't sense the slightest trace of them in their bodies. It's as if their souls have taken leave of their physical forms. That's the same thing that happened with Thancred. Yeah, that's what the uh, Elder Seed Seer said. Yes. Have. The Elder Seed Seer made a similar observation. I've read the report. When you heard this mysterious voice, you described feeling as if you were somewhere else, yes? If we assume the ether which comprises your essence is being drawn to some other place, then it may be possible to follow the trail it leaves behind, just as we did in our search for Thancred. Girl, we're doing that shit again? I wasn't around for that, but I can't imagine it was easy. To see Matoya oh, again it wasn't. But that's no reason not to try. I will have need of Master Matoya's crystal eye if I'm even to make the attempt. So I suggest we pay her a visit. Yeah. <sighs> How are we feeling, chat? hope we don't lose them i'm i'm eager to figure out what the fuck is going on to be like honest 
But there is so much that's happening that I'm also like, I don't know what I should be following. Also, what should I play right now? Should I play Dragoon? Should I play Dark Knight? Should I play Astrologian? Astrologian, whatever it's called. What do we play? Should we do Astro? Should we do some Astro shenanigans? Do we do some Summoner? Some Reaper? Bring out that shadow. <laughs> and I'll, I'll use this one this time. Mm. Dark Knight would be fitting for Shatterbringers. <laughs> Matoya, isn't she in Dr Yeah, Dravania. She's like over here somewhere, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Go here. And then we'll go back. Man, Alize, Carl, and Matoya gotta be some of my favorite NPCs. I remember loving Matoya a lot. It's been a hot minute since we've seen her, so I'm really excited to- Oh, I'm actually scared. I wonder what she's gonna say when um when we tell her what's happened to uh, Ishtola. That's gonna be interesting. But yeah, I loved I loved Matoya. I was simping for her. Maybe I do have a thing for old people. Hmm. <laughs> Living Shadow? No, I don't. Were you with me when I discovered that I had more, um, abilities? I think you were. It's... It's this one, and this one, and this one that I never, um, mapped. Um, I'll, I'll put that there. Because remember we were making jokes about the Dark Missionary? <laughs> um, I don't know what else to... I guess I can get rid of that, because I have that there. And I guess, like, interject. Because I have that down there. Yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna have to do a cleanup. I'm 100% gonna have to do a cleanup. I'm running out of, um... I'm running out of spots. I guess the limit break I could get- no. Uh, no, I could get out of the limit break and put it on um on here. Oh, that's actually a good idea. That's actually a really fucking good idea. Put it on one of these. Oh, that's a good idea. I'll figure that out later. Those are really good abilities, are they? I will keep that in mind. Was that there? I think you were. I was either you or Jin or somebody. I th actually, no, I think it might have just been just No, it was! No, I think it was on stream because I was making jokes about Dark Missionary. How, uh, Missionary in the Dark is, um, a thing. <laughs> I can fly here, right? Yeah, I can. Remove low blow? I don't know what low blow is. What's low blow? Where's low blow? What's low blow? Where's- Where's low blow? What's low blow? What's- What's... 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 It's the stun? Oh, this! Okay. Well, I'll, um... Girl, I'll fucking deal with my, my abilities later. Alright. I need to spend at least, like, one day figuring out my hotbar for Astro. Figuring out a cleaner hotbar for Dark Knight. And a better one for Dragoon. My Dragoon is so- I mean, y'all saw it. It's awful. I use stuns all the time. I usually use stuns all the time too, but I mean, if the pros are saying not to, then I could get rid of it. I use stuns all the time when I'm playing Dragoon. Anytime they like turn around, I scream on the inside. <laughs> Astro has so many buttons to press. Does it? I mean, yeah, the micromanaging is insane. I only recently looked at the other abilities today. Um, what was it? Not Astrodome. It was um the other like tarot card stuff. I didn't realize I unlocked like a queen and a king, which was really cool. I still don't know what those do. And I just I just remembered as well. So like I was always wondering like, am I using the cards properly or not? Because when I first unlocked Astro, CJ told me she was like, blue is for tank, green is for support, and red is for uh, melee. And then I read them today, 
and that's not true at all! That's not true at all! And so now I have to like kind of like relearn the cards <laughs> and I'm so frustrated. It's not true! It's like, it's ewer or whatever, and then the arrow, and then balance, I think, for DPS, melee DPS and tank, and then the, the, the tree, and the other two are for range and, and support. I didn't know that! I did not know that at all! It was CJ! CJ told me that like forever ago when I first grabbed Astro. And she's like, girl, it's easy. You just look at the outline. And I was like, okay. I'd heard Master Matoya was something of a recluse, but this seems extreme. Still, I'll happily overlook her eccentric eccentricities if she agrees to help us. I mean, I do look at the outline, but she told me blue tank, red, uh, red DPS, and then green support. And I was like, cool. And I've been running that forever. And then I started tinkering with my stuff a little bit today, and I was like, or the other day, and I was like, wait a minute. Wait, Astro's getting redone in 7.0? This is summoner all over again. This is summoner all, summon, summon, mamana all over again. Ooh. 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 Let's see how this goes. Come to disturb my peace again, have you? I hide myself away in a cave, and still you people insist on pestering me with your problems. Oh, I mistook you for young what's name, but oh, I no see we. now you're the sister. Weren't you supposed to be the lively one? Oh. I've seen happier faces at a rain sodden burial. Well, let me tell you. Well, I'm sorry to dash your expectations, but the situation isn't exactly conducive to gaiety. Ha! That's more like it. Stoller used to spit and hiss like a wildcat, too. Better for a young thing like you to be filled with fire and leave the doom and gloom to your elders. Girl. She reminds me of Sophie from House now, of the Castle. You know, what exactly does that, this like, tragic situation of yours have to do with me? If I may, Master Matoya, we have need of your crystal eye once more. What did we use the eye for? I don't remember what we used it for last time. Wasn't it to... Oh, it was to find Thancred or something? And Stola is one of the afflicted? Is she? Very well. She may be an ungrateful stray, but she's my ungrateful stray, and I'll not see her buried before I am. I love her staff still, how it's like a wooden hand. Okay. So what we do right. here? Let us see what we can see. I'll begin from where our friends first fell and cast my senses out from there. Jay, you know this. My soft spot. Oh, she can't find them. Oh. What is it? Did you find them? This doesn't make sense. How is it even possible? What? Did she find them? Or? How is what possible? Cryle, what did you see? The, th the threads, they just... 
It just ended. And, and no, I didn't lose track of them. I followed them as far as they went. It's as if... It's as if they were cut off. Could the ether have dissipated if it had? Oh, oh God! Their bodies are just husks. It's like the broodmother's daughter all over again. No, no, th this is different. The Kalyana girl was already dead, body and soul, when Lakshmi affected her resurrection. Aye, let's not jump to conclusions. If their physical forms yet breathe and show no signs of wasting, then it follows that their souls must still be intact somewhere. But where? That's the question, isn't it, girl? Death has not taken them to the ethereal sea, yet there are no tracks left for us to follow. We're no closer to an answer than when we started. But knowing their souls are still out there is progress of a sort. We just have to keep looking. Pray, excuse me a moment. Who is it? 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 Is it Elise? Yes. I remember, but... What? To Alamigo? We're on our way. Was it Lise? That was Lise. Apparently, a group of Popularis have defected to Alamigo, and Maxima, the envoy Alphano left with, is one of them. I'm sorry. I realize we've barely begun here, but... Go, child, go! You've made up your mind, and life's too short for dithering. I'll do some digging in the meantime, and see if there isn't some other method we could use to continue the search. Let's be off, then. I feel so bad for Alize. It really feels like she's losing everybody. Oh, not again. The enchantment barely seems to take these days. I'd chalk it up to old age, but I rather doubt it's that simple. Before they took ill, Yishtola and Urianger were sharing notes on a thinning of the ether. It seems to be happening all over. Does it now? And here I was, all set to blame my woes on that creaking mountain of refuse clogging up the Thaliac. I fear something has gone awry. That's what we Still, suspect as well. Still, there's naught to be gained from starting at shadows. You can only do what can be done, and that but one thing at a time. Yeah, you can, you can really feel Alize's anxiety, and I, I love it. I love it so much. The voice actor for her does a splendid job. The panic in her voice, like the frantic like yelling or raising her her voice rather i love it dot purple thank you so much for the prompt sub i appreciate it oh <laughs> now i want indian food get your indian food but don't pull a me i got indian food and shot for 30 minutes so that was the woman who tamed Ishtola. I had the distinct feeling of being grabbed by the scruff of the neck and having nonsense shaken out of me. <laughs> when Alfino is back, I'd like to visit again and ask her what tales she has of grandfather. I almost can't bear to hear what Maxima has to tell us. But it can't be bad news, can it? Nice would have said. Unless... Ugh, there's no point speculating. Lise said she'd notify the guards of her coming, so we should head straight to the palace gate to the Al in the Alamegan quarter. I'll be praying for good news. Learn what you can about Alfino's plight and leave the search for our friends and friends lost souls to me. Oh, 
Alrighty. Okay. To Alamigo then. Should I play? Should I play as Dark Knight? Or should I just stick to? I, I do want to level Dragoon some more. I think I'm gonna stay on Dragoon. When did? Why is it? Why is my armor this? What? Fuck. <laughs> All right. Let me at least change it when I get to um Urbania. Y'all say no, the food was good. It was literally, it was literally so good. It was so good, it all came out immediately. Because it's the same as Reaper. No, I had it set to something else. I swear, see, it's this. See, okay, it just bugged. See, look. <laughs> now, now, now. I think I'll just play in this. Okay, so where am I going? Why can't it be easier? Why are there no little like etherites here? Why can't this be easier to navigate? No! Look! Look! Reaper! Dragoon! See? It glitched! It bugged out! I swapped to Dragoon, but it did a thingy. But if I... What? No! No! When you're outside of a town! I wasn't reclaiming. Oh, I'm having deja vu. No! Didn't I just try, like... Oh, wait. Oh, my God. No, I did open the glamour plate. But I didn't try applying anything. I was switching my role to Dragoon. And it, it bugged out. It gave me the hat. When my Dragoon is linked to something else. Someone clip it. Because I can't see. I, I don't know what I was doing. It's too late. I don't care anymore. All right. We're going back to this. I swear all I did was click Dragoon. And then it gave me my Reaper gear with the Dragoon bottoms. Like, the glam did not, like, load? It couldn't apply the plate where you were? That's not how that works. I swear that's not how that works. Because when I'm out in public, out in public, when I'm in other places and I'm swapping between my other, my other things, they all load fine. I made it my Reaper glam. But did I choose Reaper? Or did I choose Dragoon? What did I choose? What did I choose? What did I even do? Yeah, I moved to Dragoon. Oh my god, I feel like I'm being gaslit. I feel like I'm being gaslit. I need to look back. I don't know what I did. My memory of literally the last like five minutes is already gone. It's fine. Just pretend it's a glitch. Now that sounds like gaslighting. Hold on. You were like, hey, look at this cute Reaper Glam, get it? Because you were- but you were on Dragoon while you did it. This was almost- That was an hour ago?! That was an hour ago?! When I showed y'all that?! But I didn't apply it. I just showed you it and I- and I looked at the weapon and then I moved past it. I never applied it. I'm literally going through my VOD right now. I feel like I'm going crazy. I never applied it. Hold on. I'm I'm opening my VOD. My VOD is open. I'm looking. Let's see. What did I do here? Yeah! Hold on. Yeah! I'm not dumb! I'm not dumb! I know I- Y'all are gaslighting me! Look! Look! Dragoon equipped! And I was like, what the fuck? And then I did that, and it said unable to glamour plates, and so then I went here, and then I went back and forth, and then it gave me the proper glam! And 
And earlier, I never applied it. I just showed it because I opened up this and I was like, Haha, look at this. It's 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 my it's my reaper gear and I'm a farmer because I have a scythe. Get it? I did that and I was like, oh, there's no weapon. You can't see. And then I moved on. That meant it couldn't apply. That's not how that works. That's not how that works. That's not how that works. I could be literally anywhere. Where's a where's a place? I could be anywhere if I change my thing. The glamour plate that is linked to the to the class gets swapped. No. Yeah. But that's because I tried opening the glamour plate and it wouldn't even let me do. It wouldn't even let me do that. What? Am I insane? Am I insane? I'm gonna try this. Oh wait, that's the wrong place. That's the wrong place. I'm gonna try this. Am I insane? Have I never clued in on this? I think I think I'm going insane. The MSQ is on pause so I can figure this out. I'm I'm in I'm in I'm in awe. I'm in utter awe. I'm in awe. It has to be a town? I'm in awe. Okay, does this count? Is this far enough? I've left the sanctuary. Okay. Oh my god. Is this true? You're all liars. You're all fucking liars. You're all liars. No. No. You're all liars. No. No. Oh, it's between Dragoon and Reaper? Oh! <gasps> What? But this glam is working and this glam is working. But why when I loaded my Dragoon, it, pl it, it loaded the wrong th Ah! This makes no sense. Do they share the- This is number nine! This is number six! They don't share it! This has plate number nine. This has plate number six. They share gear. Yeah, okay. They share gear. Okay, wait. Okay, the gear is the same. But why? But why? When I when I put on Dragoon, it didn't give me my Dragoon Glam. But they didn't give me the Dragoon Glam. It gave me the wrong Glam. Why? I had Dragoon equipped. I never equipped Reaper this stream. I never applied that glam. So why, when I went to the Dragoon, it gave me the wrong glam? But why would it give me the wrong glam? When I never equipped that glam? That's so... Oh! To the one that was already gla- That is so s- But why- But I ne- But why would it- But I didn't have- But when I never- I never applied the- Did I apply the- Oh! I may have applied the Reaper Glam at some point. Did I? I must have equipped it at some point. Oh! I did? Oh, I gaslit myself. I gaslit myself. It was I who gaslit. It was me. It was me all along. I must have then. <laughs> it all comes back to amnesia. It all comes back to amnesia. We've come full circle. <laughs> there it is. But will, but will I be redeemed, chat? Will I be redeemed? <laughs> will I be redeemed, though? I feel like the hottest of... No, it wasn't when... It wasn't that. It was at another point. I don't think it was that point. Or maybe it was that point. Oh. 
<laughs> it's the thinning of the ether, exactly. The ether is thin in this in this area. Look, okay. My brain cells. My soul has left my body. I am but a husk, holding a controller. There's an Asian in me right now. God, I wish there was no, no. That's an old man. Well, well. He can put that assy in assy in me. That was that was so bad. I wanted to feel proud about that one, but I just can't. <sighs> it's all because you shouldn't do another reality. It's all because of that. I know the voice in my head. The voices. The voices. <laughs> Oh, this fucking game. She's baby. She must be redeemed. Exactly. That's how the story goes. Where's Alfie you now? I thought they all went together. Where's Alfie you now? Wait, what the fuck? Oh no, it was just Alfie you know, and what's his face, right? I'm sorry to drag you halfway across the realm, but when Maxima mentioned Alfino. You know, I thought you'd want to hear the news in person. Ah, we meet again. Though I was hoping our reunion would be under more auspicious circumstances. Oh my god, I remember. Because I had an inner monologue moment with myself. I switched to the Reaper thingy, and then I thought, I don't want to see that fucking straw hat in a cutscene. And so I swapped! <laughs> but I didn't say it out loud! <laughs> I'm remembering it's coming back! Okay. Anyways, back to the cutscene. <laughs> what happened to my brother? Where is Alphino? Never fear, my lady. Your brother was in fine health when I took my leave of him, and I have no reason to assume that has changed. You assume? If you will allow me, I shall endeavor to explain events. I have a question. Why do some of the Garleans have, like, vaginal, um, stones, and some of them have, like, really round stones? Like, this one's kind of, like, pussy-ish. It looks like a vagina with, like, an enlarged clitoris. It's just a facial feature? Okay, but I want to get down to it. Something about how pure their blood is. Round is for royal pure blood. Oh. Mm. Oh. So if you're... If you're biracial... If you're biracial, then it's... Pussy-ish. I see. Our troubles began not long after we departed Doma. While crossing the burn, we were fired upon by the Emperor's personal guard and forced to make an emergency landing. As we stumbled from the wreckage, our attackers fell upon us again, and we would have perished there and then were it not for the intercession of a third party, a band of mercenaries whose leader claimed to pursue a vendetta against the Asians. This Shadow Hunter, as he styled himself, then escorted us out of the wastes to relative safety. Upon arriving back in civilization, I gathered my Populara's colleagues and prepared to flee the Empire. Master Alphino, however, declined the invitation to join us, preferring to continue his investigation right. into the Asian threat. Well... At least he's not lying in a heap in the burn. He's safe, baby girl. He's okay. Tell us more about these Asian hunters. Who are they? And is Alphano still with them? He is. As to who they are, I'm afraid I have nothing to tell you. Beyond the fact that they root out and destroy Asians, they were unwilling to divulge anything which might serve to identify them. They would not even reveal their next destination. But Master Alphino asked to accompany them all the same. Since parting company with your brother, we've been engaged in a game of cat and mouse with the Emperor's guard. 
We made our way through province after province, finding the army busy restoring order wherever we went, until we finally arrived here in Alamigo. I cannot thank Commander Aldin enough for giving us such an unexpectedly warm welcome. I'm not inclined to turn away refugees, no matter which land they call home. And if they can tell me how things lie in Garlemald, all the better. On that subject, there is much I would tell you. During the course of our journey, we heard tales that an entire rebel army had been slaughtered in the space of a single night. It would seem my former comrades grew tired of putting down uprisings in the conventional manner, and chose instead to bring a formidable new weapon to bear. Details were sparse, but the rumor alone was enough to dampen the flames of rebellion. I have also heard reports that several companies have withdrawn from their designated provinces and begun marching I'm westward. Scared of what the Black Rose could it is do. my assessment that the Empire's forces like are mobilizing for a large scale that. military engagement. Westward? You mean they're getting ready to invade Alamigo? We knew this was coming, but not that it would be so soon. We've barely even begun to shore up our defenses. They won't stop an invading army. No, they won't. Dispatch messengers to the Alliance leadership requesting reinforcements, and send word to our officers in the field to hasten completion of those border fortifications. Prepare to meet the Imperials head on! You hear that, by the way? I'm filing my nails. No matter how quickly we act, we still want for time. When the enemy comes into view, our best recourse will be to open negotiations with their commander, and see that the ensuing proceedings take as long as possible. Would you and Alize head to Doma and let Lord Hien know about this? I'm sure he'll want to hear about Alfino too. Consider it done. We'll send word when- Oh, again? Untold sorrow must be changed. Ahead looms a calamity. Eon become instant. Throw wide the gates. Who is that? It's not Asahi, right? No. No, it's... I don't... Is it <sighs> Solas? You heard it too. God, I hate saying that. <laughs> well, at least we're both still standing. I hate saying is that Solas? <laughs> oh, thank the gods. I thought we'd lost you for a moment there. Why does this keep happening? Girl, I don't know. I wish I knew. Nothing we've tried has brought us any closer to an answer. We'll keep working on it. But first, we need to go and see Lord Hien. Yeah, for some reason, Alize is okay. I think they said that Thancran passed out because of um, how weak he's gotten. And I'm presuming so is the same for Ishtola and Uriange. But would that be the. S but oh, I don't know. So Alfino is safe for the present at least. Now all we need to worry about is the full scale Imperial invasion. I'm actually glad Lys tasked us with visiting Hien. Better to be dashing from place to place and sitting around stewing over things we can't change. The Enclave. Here we go. This way. Artist. Oh, nope. Right, the Enclave. I got a T. Fuck, I got a TP from here. Okay, let's see. I guess I can just like quickly shling over this way. Yeah, that's faster. Can I flash drive? Take care. Thank you for hanging out. Would you rather say, is that Granddaddy? Because those are kind of our only options. Oh, Granddaddy. I guess I could. If I started saying, is that granddaddy, would you all know who I'm referring to? Would you all know I mean Solus? <laughs> I guess both Soluses are super, super old, ancient men. <laughs> I'm 
Yeah, okay, so then maybe I'll just start saying granddaddy. <laughs> you have a type? I do. I'm ashamed to admit that. People whose names are soulless, apparently. <laughs> That's the type. Greetings, my friends. I was just discussing future endeavors with the members of our new formed alliance. Kojin and the Confederacy you already know, and it was your own strength of arms that won us the cooperation of the Step Tribes. Hell yeah. Good job! We have also been joined by our neighbors from, I don't know how to pronounce that, Nasia, Nasha, and the indomitable citizens of Dalmasca. Though the scattered nature of the latter's resistance will somewhat delay their, their official induction. These people, these proud peoples, have united under a single purpose to stand against the tyranny of the Garlean Empire. Every time I read Garlean, I think I'm about to say garlic. Thank you for the hydration, Jen. Is it because I'm thirsty? I'm glad to see your alliance is coming together so swiftly. As things stand, I fear we shall soon have need of your strength. What'd you do, Carnage? Why are you saying it so ominously? I thank you for bringing me news of Alfino. You know. Oh, wrong voice. His fate is never his fate is never far from my thoughts, and not only because he is our emissary. As for the sudden deployment of Imperial forces, I agree that Alamigo would be wise to shore up its borders with all haste. Garlic mold! The moldy garlic! Their headbeads should be garlic cloves, you're so right. You're so, so right. Every report we receive from our shinobi indicates a massing of troops in the western provinces. It seems all but certain that the Empire is poised to bring its fist down on Eosia. I would help deflect that blow, but I cannot risk sending reinforcements just yet. We will remain vulnerable to airborne assault until our wall in the burns is in place. The all-important Al Alagan... Alagon, Alagon energy barrier. It's Alagon, right? I don't remember how it's pronounced. I'll be frank. The energy barrier, yes. I thought to call it something more auspicious. Name drawn from the Four Lords of Legend, perhaps. Serius Aegis, or some such. Well, just a thought. The Ironworks engineers report that they have finished collaborating the generators and are ready to proceed to the testing stage. Ooh. Have you tried? Have you time to attend the first test? You've seen the field which protected as this law firsthand, and I'd be interested to hear how you think of ours compares. I will come too if you don't mind. I am no Ishthola. I may be able to offer some insight. Of course, of course. Time being of the essence, it would be best if we made directly for the burn. Yuguri, I leave you and Hakuro to bring the war council to a close. Understood. The mounts are saddled and ready, my lord. Where the storms? Money! Give me a lot of money. Ginger salad? You know what? I'm gonna take the ginger salad. It was meant to be. And I'm gonna eat it too. Alagon and Alagan. Alagon, Alagan, Alagon, Alagon. 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 Look, I have peach juice. I have a really good quality hot chocolate. I got croissants and I got cookies. And you best believe I'm gonna give them to everybody. We will cross the burn by Yol and Falcon as before. Join me at the overlook near the House of the Fierce. The overlook by the House of the Fierce. I can TP there, right? Right? Yeah, I got cookies. I got cookies. I got bored and I was looking in the marketplace and I was just buying random ass shit. And then I found the, the, the foodies and stuff. And I thought they were cute. And I like the idea of Pepper just hoarding like hot chocolate croissants and cookies. <laughs> There's something about that that sounds like very fi oh, For fuck's sake. That sounds very fitting. Oh, is this a dungeon? 
<gasps> Wait. Am I dungeoning it up? Wait, how do I get up there? How do I? How do I? Is there... Oh, can I go up this way? Oh. Ooh. Is it dungeon time? I logged off. Save it for me. Say less. I'm surprised viewers haven't filled inventory with random food. Oh, no, no, no. My inventory has been filled with random food, but I've eaten every single thing that they've given me. Or I have, um, given it away. <laughs> Give the word when you're ready to take wing. Head to the burn. I'm heading to the burn. Seen time, babes. I know I did have 999 eggs before, I think, but then I started eating them. <laughs> it seems the engineers have matters well in hand. God, he's so handsome. Should the barrier work as we intend, Doma will be free to reinforce her allies in Alamigo I without fear of Doma. weakening her Doma. own borders. Doma. Honored friends, the time has come to put your hard work to the test. Start the generator. Node 1 is operational. Nodes 2 to 8 are reporting similar energy levels. The barrier is forming. One thousand yams. Two thousand. Three thousand. Expansion remains smooth. No fluctuations detected. Hey, yo. No, it's too good to be true. Oh, is it gonna work? Let's go 4,000! 5,000! Target altitude reached! The barrier is holding steady at 5,000 yams! Holy We've done shit. it! Hey! Is that an Imperial airship? Of all the rotten timing. But this is a gift, Anna. Mistress Alize. They can Anna. test our new wool for us. Oh, watch it not work. Oh, shit. Oh. Seems solid enough. Though I was hoping for a fireball. Mm hmm. Who's gonna come out? Is that the Shadow Man? <gasps> oh! What happened to him? By the gods, it's Alpha No. What are you? Let me go! He has my brother! Lower the barrier! Oh my god, did it knock him out? Like the voice? Be at ease, girl. The lad is not dead, merely locked in slumber. No, not him too. Oh. Oh. Oh, she can't catch a break. It was Elfie. No, I guessed correctly, and I told myself that 
was a stupid question. We could identify no cause and found no remedy. Thus I sought to return him to Doma, and into the arms of Lord Hien himself, it would seem. It is a day for fated reunions. Reunions? Would you not agree, adventurer? Or should I address you as the Warrior of Light? Reunion? Gaius van Baelsar, the Black Wolf. That was the title I was given. He's One I've so long since hot. Relinquished. He's so hot. Oh Stand no! Down. The Legatus of the 14th Imperial Legion died in Castrum Meridianum. I am no more than Gaius Baelsar, a man without rank or allegiance. Damn. Reforms. Impossible. There's no way you could have survived. Do you remember how it unfolded? How I was deceived by Lahabrea? How I was convinced that reviving the Ultima weapon would allow me to bring peace to Eorzea? The Essian used me, as he used so many others, all to further the restoration of his wretched god. Yet even with the might of Alec at my command, you bested me. And as the Praetorium went up in flames, I was content to burn along with it. For a moment, at least. A moment of folly. To surrender my life thus would have been to betray all who died for my cause. It was for them that I dragged myself free of the rubble, and swore vengeance on the Assians. The Black Wolf has shed his pelt, never to return to Garlemald or her legions. I live now only to exact revenge. Okay. My principal quarry was to be Lahabrea, whom I gather you have since ushered onto oblivion. But so many more remain. Long as their kind lurked in the shadows, laboring that's, to sow chaos throughout our world, I would see each and every one dragged into the light and put to the sword. So we're bringing them Are out the of the shadows? Are the Scions not of like mind? In this single respect, perhaps. Then I shall continue the partnership the boy began, and share what intelligence I have acquired. Among the Asians, the black-masked ilk are subordinate to those who wear red. This you already know. Yet among the red there exists a hierarchy. Those set adrift with the shards clearly stand below those still joined to the source. Nabriales, who once dared to intrude upon the rising stones, belonged to the former group. And while he was indeed a dangerous foe, his powers were inconsequential next to the paragons of the source. Wait, thanks for the sub. The first was Lahabrea, who plagues us no more. There is also the white-robed Elidibus, and the elusive Emmet Selk, about whom little is known. We have files on Lahabrea and Elidibus, but I believe this Emmet Selk is new to us? As I assume my brother told you, we have evidence to suggest that an Asian now walks in the body of the Crown Prince. Have you identified this interloper? Elidibus seems the most likely culprit. As emissary, it is his role to maintain the equilibrium between darkness and light. 
Your many deeds in Heidelin's name have upset the balance, and I believe he seeks to restore it by throwing his considerable power behind the Empire. As a leader of the Asians, he is one of our primary targets. It was on the trail of this very prey that the boy and I came across the scene of a failed uprising. In the absence of a single Galian casualty, we inspected the bodies of the rebels, and the lack of any external injury drew my immediate attention. They had been slain by Black Rose, an alchemical invention of the Imperial Army. When I yet served as Legatus, I ordered its production halted, and all stockpiles destroyed. Toxic gas is not a tool of conquest, but of extermination. Toxic gas? This must be the new weapon Maxima warned us about. Something deadly enough to sweep away all resistance in a matter of hours. Gods. You don't think they're planning to use this in Alamigo, do you? Put your fears to rest. We infiltrated the production facility and destroyed all existing stores of the chemical along with the plant itself. Even should they rebuild the operation, they will not soon manufacture another batch. That's going to come back in Shadowbringers, I just know it. Regardless, I would draw your attention to a directive we discovered in the plant's records. The document was marked with a recent date and authorized with the signature of one Zeno C. A. Galvis. A dead man signing the death warrant for thousands. Tis bad comedy. But the tale does not end there. Within that same facility was a chamber filled with devices of elegant design. Cloning technology, we realized. And what should we find in each and every incubator? But a young Emperor Solus. All of which prompts the question, were the Asians responsible for these abominations, or was it the will of the Emperor? I must know which hand guides the Empire. Though I have given up my rank, I am yet a son of Garlemald, and I will fight for the future of my homeland. It is time I return to the Hunting of Shadows, we should focus on our common foe. To reopen old quarrels now would serve no purpose. You saved my brother's life, so I'm willing to let sleeping dogs lie. But in truth, it's not my decision to make. Mine? Not Hyun's? You're right, there are more important matters at hand. We'll say this another time. There are more important matters. There was a time when I scorned those who placed their faith in false gods. Even as I, in my blinkered conviction, placed mine in Asian promises. Unlike yours, my strength of will and my restraint was found wanting. We shall meet again, warrior of light. See, that's a redemption so that arc was I the can get behind. Black Wolf, an unexpected ally, to say the least. Ally. <laughs> He's an ally. Well, I am content to leave the fine tuning of the barrier to cleverer minds. Let us bid our friends from the Ironworks farewell and see what can be done for Alphino back in Dorma. Sweet boy. I'm so glad they've reunited, even though he's knocked the fuck out. Poor Alize, man. I'm so scared that something isn't gonna go right here. I feel like she's gonna have, like, this weird, like... Ugh, dramatic, like... 
this dramatic arc, maybe, maybe oh, I don't want to say Alfino doesn't make it. What if Alfino doesn't make it and then she goes all like cuckoo bananas? Oh. Uh. Four more quests? Are we doing it, chat? Alfino is safely en en ensconced in a private uh, chamber. My finest healer is examining him as we speak. I've spoken with the physician and there are no outward signs of illness. Alfino is lost in a sleep from which he cannot be awoken, just like the others. It seems that even the lands of the Empire were not far enough away to escape that cursed voice. I share your frustration, Alize, I do. But Alfino has returned to us alive and otherwise unharmed. All that remains is to find the means to wake him. Until then, you can but fulfill your duties as a scion, yours and your brothers both. You're right, of course. There are arrangements to be made, and little time to make them. To business then, my lord. Now that we know Seiryu's wall works as intended, can we expect reinforcements for Alamigo? You most certainly can. As promised, we will send troops to, bo to bolster our allies in Eorzea without delay. Pray be aware, however, they, that they will not arrive without delay. Save for some few who boast teleportation magics, the bulk of our force must be transported by sea. A lengthy voyage for which the smaller vessels is favoured, but the Confederacy are ill-equipped. Accordingly, I mean to enlist the assistance of the East Aldenar uh, Trading Company in finding suitable ships. As for navigating the distances in question, we are in the happy position of being able to call upon those who plotted the course of my people's exodus in Eorzea. Beyond the procurement of ships, I think, it's unlikely it unlikely that our East Aldernod friends will consent to any involvement in military operations, but I am certain they will afford Alfino a berth aboard one of their a berth? One of their vessels. I shall have a how do you pronounce it? Chirurgeon? 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 Right? Chirurgeon? Something like that? Accompany him every elm of the way to the Rising Stones. I feel like I can say it in my head, but I can't say it out loud. It's another one of those. You have my thanks, Lord Hien. You agree. I will go on ahead with our friends to El Amigo. Enlist all those capable of teleportation and put them at the disposal of the Eorzean Alliance as soon as possible. They will form the Vanguard. Yes, my lord. This is exactly what we'd hoped for. Least and the Alliance leaders will be glad indeed to welcome the combined strength of the East. So if there are four quests left, how long do you think that would be? Meanwhile, at the Black Rose chemical plants. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it was too good to be true. It's grandson. Our supplies of Black Rose have been ruined, but the new plant is already under construction. We should have the first batch ready in time for the offensive, your radiance. See that you do. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. What did I say? What did I fucking say? Ah, yes, the infamous Black Rose. If I recall correctly, Gaius did not much care for the invention. I love his hair. <laughs> A ruthless and indiscriminate weapon indeed, this airborne poison. It seems you are capable of making decisions worthy of your bloodline. <laughs> With no gift for sorcery, we Garleans must look to Magitek to even the odds. If it spares the needless deaths of our soldiers and serves the cause of this empire, there is no method I would not employ. How very noble of you. Truly, though, I must commend you for embracing your role as Emperor. You play the part of the determined ruler... well. Sometimes even I catch myself believing. He's such a snarky shit. A silent agent of death. Now that I think on it, Black Rose may well possess the perfect aspect. Slowly but surely, 
The deluge of light has worked upon the ether here in the source, and the gas should be most susceptible to its influence. <laughs> I lost your choice. Well, I shall leave you to your own devices. Go forth and bloody the land with your grand and glorious war. I love his fit. He's kind of free. Well, you do what precisely? Need you ask? I will be doing what all Asians do. He is a he is an Asian. I am well aware that your kind exists only to usher in the next calamity. Girl, we but just you had the eighth one a couple hours ago when I shot. But you seem oblivious to the singular agenda causes to the Empire. It was the eighth bumbrel calamity. You cannot have forgotten the events which followed your mortal demise. Our homeland was plunged into civil war for your failure to name a successor. The edifice you so carefully constructed was but a hair's breadth from collapse. Are you truly so naive? You thought me oblivious to the consequences of a departure so painstakingly timed? It was by design. Well, of course it was. Though I will admit the resulting panic exceeded even my wildest expectations. But how can you be surprised? Throwing the world into disarray was the very purpose for which this nation was, as you say, so carefully constructed. God is us. Now, if you have no further questions, I must be on my way. Since we may not meet again in this lifetime, it would be remiss of me not to offer a word or two of gratitude. I really must thank you for this surplus of vessels. I can mold any host into my own image, but having bodies tailor-made for me in this fashion is so much less tiresome. Oh yeah, because they had yeah. you dabbled in elegant cloning techniques. Yes, it certainly is a compelling, not to mention entertaining, field of research. And of all the options available, you chose the founding father on whom to experiment. You have a twisted streak to you, Varus, like grandsire, like grandson. Hey? Why do I love him? Oh no. If oh, events no. play out as planned, this He's will be such a little shit. A family enterprise. Or I guess an old shit. You will be the capstone of this world. Oh, no. I, the anchor in the shard, and together to kill you, my we boy. will give the lie Sorry. to this star's fraudulent existence. <laughs> He's insane. I love him. Maybe I could fix him. Nah. <laughs> and yes, that was my joke too. It literally looks like he has a ball gag around his neck. Okay, so how many more? Is there four more? Is there four more now or is there three more now? Alright, here we go. We must leave now to convene with Eorzea's leaders and it may be some time before I return to Doma. Hakuro, Hakuro, I leave you in command. My lord. I shall assemble an advance party with all haste and join you and Alamigo forthwith. <laughs> Fix my empire building, Grandad, please. <laughs> I'm here till you get there. Good. Two more to the end of 4.5, and then you're in 4.5. 4.56? 
I've just received word from Lise. The Alliance established a base camp near Alamigo's northeastern border. Oh, sorry. I've just re received word from Lise. The, Al the Alliance established a base camp near Alamigo's northeastern border. Once we arrived in the locks, we're to report to a resistance officer stationed in Porta Pretoria who will point us in the right direction. Let's not keep them waiting. Okay. Um, I am just going to really quickly get um, my um, my Vix because my throat from all the talking and laughing and stuff is getting like a little irritated. Uh, so give me one second, please. Adrian! Adrian, thank you so much for the raid! I do have the best fix ever, and actually this is a good reminder that I need to buy more. I've run out. Adrian, I hope you had a great stream. Hello friends, my name is Syra. I am a Final Fantasy XIV streamer. Um, and an RPG streamer, I guess you could say. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are hauling ass through the post-Stormblood content. We are hoping, praying, to get to the end of it tonight. I only have four quests left. So we're, um, yeah, we're making progress. Buckle up. Hydrate on top of the Vix. I will, I will. I will, I will. Let me just rub myself up. And only three Scions left. Yeah! Wait, only three? No, there's only two of us. Oh no, there's Kryle. Yes. Oh, hi, Jay. Wait, Jay, why are you here? If you're here, if you're here, that's a bad sign. That's a bad omen. That means something is coming. Apple splits here too. What is this? Ah, uh, you must be the scion party I was told to look out for. If you'll follow me, I'll take you directly to the Alliance Headquarters. I'm gonna have to catch the VODs. That's okay, Sarnix. I appreciate you trying. It is late for most people. It's late for me too, but I'm so determined to get through this. Don't mind me huffing. Welcome back, you two. Greetings, Lord Hian. Glad you could join us. Glad to be here. I would have come sooner, were our own defense is not in question, but I am pleased to report that our soldiers are assembling for deployment to Alamigo as we speak. 
We're grateful for your support. Thanks to the efforts of our allies, it won't be long before we've established defensive positions on this front as well. <clears throat> we have some good news too. Alphano has come back to us. As for the bad news... He's asleep! His soul is gone! I guess you could say he's soulless. So, Alphano won't wake up. Gaius van Baelsar is alive and hunting Assians, and the Empire is planning to poison us all with toxic gas. Does that sound about right? Ordinarily, any one of those things would have left me in shock. But the way things have been lately, it's all starting to seem pretty normal. Getting back to your report, are we sure this Black Rose is the weapon Maxima was talking about? It fits the description. And it seems we have Alfino to thank for sparing us an early demonstration of its effectiveness. I have a feeling this won't be the last time his bravery in the Empire will serve us here in Eosia. You better not go down like Louis Soir, I swear to God. The threat of an unknown weapon has had us all on edge. But now that we know what we're dealing with, we can take steps to defend against it. As for Gaius, I'm not sure what to think. Am I happy he's alive? Not in the slightest. Am I happy he's hunting Assians? Aye. I'd have to say I am. Mm-hmm. He's pulling his weight somehow. Oh, speaking of Garlians you didn't expect to see, we have a tale of our own, as it happens. When we sent envoys to the Imperial Army to request talks, they returned with the message that Varis Sos Galvus would be attending. No shot, eh? The Emperor himself. Well, Varis did sanction the Popularis peace mission. But knowing that an Assian walks in his son's skin, I do not see how we can trust him or anyone from that nest of vipers. The Alliance would proceed with negotiations regardless, if only to give ourselves more time to prepare. We do, however, require your cooperation. Ah, uh, right. Yes. So, as a condition for the talks to go forward, the Empire has requested that a member of the Scions be present. There'll be a representative from each Alliance nation, of course, but I'm afraid we have to ask that you come along too. Assians are like, are like, how would you describe an Assian? They're like a celestial, spooky yuki, spirity, demony, shadowy, humany things, right? Beings. The oh, weirdos. And so. There is an Assian in the body of Solus, because he said, oh, there are a bunch of clones. You made it so easy for me to pick a vessel. Assians can't, can they reproduce? Or? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> Ah, I don't understand. I'm, I'm, co I'm connecting the dots. I'm connecting the dots. The dots are, the dot, the dots are being connected. I'm connecting them. I'm connecting them. They're being God, please. You know how much I hate politics. But then, what choice do I have? Alphano and the others aren't going to do it. Check Discord when you can. Okay, after this. Very well. I shall attend as the Scion's representative.
In case you're wondering why I didn't ask you, the Empire also requested the presence of Eorzea's champion. I'm not fond of politics either. I'll be there. That's settled then. We don't know what Varus means to bring to the table, or why he wants you there, but having you close at hand will make all the difference. <laughs> the meeting will take place on the border. Anticipating an early assault, we mean to position the bulk of our forces nearby. The Alliance leaders should already be on their way. Once you're ready, we can head out and join them. I'm con I'm I'm connecting the dots. Chat, you you all know how good I am at predicting this game. Have I ever been wrong? When was the last time I was wrong apart from my dragoon gear? Like with the actual I'm All right, let's let's move on. Let's go. Well, I don't suppose it's polite to keep an emperor waiting too long, shall we? We were wrong about something earlier today, but I forget what. Was it Gabu? Or have you just simply forgotten because it never happened? Hmm? Amnesia. Hmm, funny how that works. <laughs> Oh, this is- this is so- uh, This is so ominous. Oh, You didn't even have to do that! You had- your pauldrons kept your cape apart from you! You didn't have to be- uh. Esteemed representatives of the Eorzean Alliance. On behalf of the Galian Empire, I thank you for inviting me here today. No, no, thank you. As this parley was convened at your request, I invite you to speak first. Very well, Your Radiance. I, Nanimo Ulnamo, 17th in the line of Ul, should be pleased to oblige you. As recent events in Alamigo and Doma have made plain, the subjugation and exploitation of neighboring nations is not a sustainable policy. Should this day end in war, you may very well defeat us, but you will never extinguish the people's desire for freedom. Though it may not be in our lifetime, there will be another revolution, another war, and the cycle will continue. Tell them. Doma has entered into a concord with the nations of Eorzea, a partnership wherein we recognize one another as equals. Garlemal could be afforded similar treatment. You need only set aside your ambitions and join us in paving a path towards peace. Yo, imagine he says, sure, bet, let's do it. <laughs> you will not win me over with sophistry, your grace. As you know only too well, this alliance lacks the strength to keep the peace within its own borders. Even now, your struggles with the Beastmen continue unabated. Divided, you sow this fertile soil with the seeds of your differences and reap naught but discord and chaos for your trouble. Now you're just repeating Eorzea what Eorzea must be united face. under one leader. One purpose. You're literally using I would offer you both and bring an end to your strife. He's copied and pasted Solus's lecture. With all due respect, your radiance, the only thing that you offered the people of Alamigo was fear and hopelessness. The citizens of Dorma can also attest to the meager arms of imperial rule. There is no purpose to be found in a life of oppression. Each day more uncertain than the last. Our people are willing to die for their freedom. 
A great many already have, and countless more will, if we don't put an end to this madness here and now. We brought order and stability to your lives. This madness and bloodshed is of your own making. You broke the peace, not Garlemald. Peace? Order? You kill our peoples, despoil our lands, take everything that is ours. And what? You expect us to lick the boot that grinds our faces into the dirt? Um. I expect you to weigh the costs. To recognize that countless lives have been lost on both sides in pursuit of a greater good, and to not squander all we have achieved in a fit of petulance. Your Radiance. I fear I can personally attest to the dangers of pursuing one's vision with such righteous fervor. For a thousand years, the Holy See of Ishgard waged war with dragons. A thousand years of sacrifice, of sorrow and hate, in which we bathed in the blood of friend and foe alike. Had it gone on any longer, we may well have drowned. Yet we have chosen to raise ourselves out of this bloody spiral and have since made peace with our former enemy. So I understand. No doubt the dragons were more receptive to your overtures in the wake of their leader's demise. You speak of peace, yet use war to achieve it. Your father would not have bothered to obscure his intent with honeyed words. He understood that strength is all that matters in the end. Jack, can I have some of my Indian food? Without his clarity of vision, I can but wonder what will become of Ishgard and her people. There was a time when Garlemald, too, lacked a leader of conviction. Weak and unable to wield magic, we were at the mercy of the strong from whom we sought refuge in the bitter cold of the north. <laughs> were it not for the discovery of Ceruleum and the subsequent development of Magitech, we might never have gained the power to take back that which was rightfully ours. You speak as if your people were the first to have been driven from their homes. Limsa Laminsa was built by wayward souls in search of a place to call their own. On the shores of Vilbrand we found it, and from those humble beginnings did we grow and flourish. I've noticed and an inconsistency with them. Without with, um, robbing our neighbors of their liberty. The volume for some of the voice clips. There's always like a random boost. So saith the pirate. Am I to believe that you simply asked the kobolds to yield up their lands and that they were happy to oblige you? That you did not drive them out like rats in the hold of one of the many ships seized by your privateers? Oof. Okay, he got her good. Yeah. I'm sorry, he got you I there. I will concede that after centuries of exile, reclamation may be mistaken for invasion. Nevertheless, it is not. And those who till stolen soil have no right to object when cast out in turn. Your uncompromising nature rivals that of the Ixal. They too lament circumstances which they themselves perpetuate. Were they but to embrace peace, we would welcome them with open arms. Indeed. Some few have done just that, and now receive of the Twelve's Woods bounty. 
would that your people might learn from their example. <laughs> you dare compare us to the Birdmen? You who thought to invoke the Twelve and threaten all of creation? I came here in the hope of finding some speck of common ground, but I see now these discussions will accomplish nothing. Despite what you people may believe, I am not wont to choose the sword over the olive branch. Tis but a pity men are loath to accept one without first being shown the other. You're also man. Garla man. Wait, I beg you. This meeting was supposed to be a chance to find a way forward together, not to bemoan the missteps which brought us here. And the child is Please. voice of reason. If you truly consider violence a last resort, there must be a way we can come to an agreement. Well? As Mistress Alizé says, we did not come here to bicker over the past, but to discuss how we might strive towards a brighter future. Yeah, girl, he knows what she said. Emperor Varys, may I suggest a short recess, that all present might compose themselves prior to beginning anew? Hmm, I don't think he's gonna like that. Very well. Oh! I pray this intermission will suffice to move these talks in a more constructive direction. Okay. I love the sound effects of the armor. The clinking, the clanking, the jingling, the... Good stuff. What's up, Alize? Phew, it's really not my forte. After his radiance and little performance, it was all I could do not to swear at him. Honestly, don't know how I ended up playing the mediator. I just asked myself what Alfino would have done and tried my best to do the same, and by some miracle it worked. There really is no common ground to be found with that man, or I think he looked for any. The question becomes, what did he come here to do? Because he may be certain it wasn't to make peace. Whatever it is, I can't make it out, not yet at least. We do have a little time before the parley is due to reconvene though, so why not try consulting our illustrious leaders? Perhaps they might have some insight to share. Alright Merwin, what's up babes? I'll say one thing for this Varus, he is well versed in Aeorzean history. His interest in our affairs is that of a beast and its prey. The conqueror would know his enemies. All should know their enemies, yet there's much and more we do not know of the Empire. It's up to us to change that. It's up to us to change that. Ha! You would have me ask the Emperor himself. Well, mayhap there is some wisdom in that. If we can skirt the storm of his displeasure, we may yet come to answers. Even if it does mean sailing close to the wind. Twelve have mercy, but for Lady Alizé's timely interjection, you might well have come to blows at the negotiations table. And we, we, we might, we might well have come to blows at the negotiating table. Okay, so that really, not them for Varus left us a great many options. Is there a conditional surrender or he will accept, do you think? Ere he arrived, I'd have said yes, but having heard him speak, I cannot help but think he came with some other end in mind. Exactly, he's building up to something, I know it. Hmm. How then should we approach the rest of the parley? Anything to say, warrior of lights? Um, say nothing of Xeno Saracians. Invite Varus to explain himself. <sighs> yeah, I guess. You believe he is more apt to reveal the truth than we put him at ease? I'm happy you are right. Thank you, Peppa. Peppa Pig. This parlay was never uh, like to bring peace. But I had hoped to learn something of Emperor Varus's relationship with the Asians, as had we all. Yet, if he is in league with them, he is not like to volunteer the fact. And if he is not, 
How much weaker would his position seem for the presence? If we are to broach that particular subject, we will need to be subtle. Would that I knew more of the man, if you would indulge me, Lord Hien. You received an imperial, edu imperial education, did you not? Is it true that Emperor's will... That the Emperor's will is considered absolute? There is no higher authority in all of Garlemald, nor else in the heavens, come to that. Veneration of the gods is forbidden, the only worship permitted being that of his radiance as one per own person. That sounds suspicious like a religion in itself. I share your disdain for the hypocrisy. Even as they denigrate the idea of faith, they revere their leader with a fervor others reserve for the divine. Yeah. Whatever. Does the flaw common to much of the doctrine they fl they fed us? Is it flood us? Logical on the surface, perhaps, but contradictory upon closer examination. I said immaccination. Oh my god. I wonder if a discussion of the various dis discrepancies might prompt Varus to reveal something. Helen, thank you for the prime sub. I appreciate it. Thank you. You've spoken with everyone, then. Good. Now all that remains is to await the pleasure of the Emperor and hope we fare better at the second attempt. Now then, who would have the floor? Me. Before we resume, I wish to offer you an apology. After you graciously accepted our invitation to discuss an armistice, we have done naught but rebuke you at every opportunity. I believe I speak for all of us when I say we are deeply sorry for they our discourtesy. They are kissing his ass and it's so funny. I mean, they have to, right? Like... I'll admit your familiarity with our affair surprised me and served to remind me how little I know of yours. I think all here can understand the desire to reclaim one's homeland, but why expand further? That is my question. If I may, the answer can be found in the Imperial Doctrine they took great pains to impart to my people. Recognizing the threat icons posed to the world, Solus Zos Galvus decreed that they were to be eradicated. To this end, he began a campaign to unite all lands under the Garlean banner. Or so we were taught. Yet the Emperor only reached the burn, the Baron said to have been laid waste by icons, after conquering all the lands that lay between. What is more, I am quite certain the practice of summoning was not nearly so widespread in the days before the Empire's founding. When you put it like that, it all starts to sound like an excuse, doesn't it? But to distract from what? Why are you really waging this war? Because fuck you! Finally, you ask the right question. I can but hope you heed mine answer and at last accept the righteousness of our cause. My goal is this. To return the world to the way it once was. Okay, Solus. The way it was always okay, meant to be. In All doing right. so, mankind will be made whole once more. He's gonna stare at me. Oh no, he's just looking across the table. No longer will we suffer from the dissension born of our differences. There will be but one race, a perfect race, as we were when time began. Hmm. What in Rolga's name are you talking about? Hmm, I feel like this has happened before. I am talking about the origins of this star of the source and its 13 reflections. At the instant of the great sundering, t'was not only the world that was shattered, but mankind itself. Thus were we divided into myriad races, each with its own unique imperfections. That is why man looks upon his neighbor and feels fear and hatred, why he wages war, why he kills he his serious? brother. 
You all in your own way have proven as much today. The peace you seek is but a fleeting solution to a fundamental problem. One which calls for more drastic measures. To bring about everlasting peace, our worlds must be rejoined. That is the goal the Empire would see realized. The glorious future unto which we shall one day shepherd mankind. A, fucking Nazi. a rejoining of worlds. I have heard this tale of the source and its reflections before. Are these not the self-same desires as the Asians? Emperor Varus, do not trust in their words. They will lead you to your doom. My father thought to use them, but in the end he succumbed to their temptations. He embraced summoning like so many other pawns before him. Do not tell us you mean to do the same. Oh, the music is stopping. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> to be a pawn, free from the burden of choice, would be a blessing. But I forswore that privilege the day I learned that the Galian Empire was built by the hand of an Asian. What? Plot twist. The drama? The zoom yes. ins? My grandsire, the former emperor, is of. But how does that make sense? And who better to build an empire capable of bringing about how the calamitous change we desire? Would you condemn me for this alliance? For bowing to the will of these shadowy masters when the prize is true okay. and lasting peace? Your prize is a lie. Your master is demons. I will stop being the Asians no matter the cost. I'm gonna snap at him. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm so 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 sorry. To free man from the prison of divergence. Imagine a world united. One perfect race beneath a single standard. An army before whose might these servants of darkness and light would fly as leaves in a storm, never again to meddle in man's affairs. We would be the masters of our own fate. Kinda spooky. I bid you join me. Not as subjects of Garamald, but of a new nation. And together we shall win freedom for ourselves and generations yet unborn. You want to trigger another half dozen calamities? You can't be serious! Have you forgotten how many died? There will be no one left! Do you truly imagine we would aid you in your bloodletting? It is unthinkable, unconscionable. I guess we'll stand too. <laughs> and what is the alternative? To be as cattle waiting for slaughter? I would have us work together, that we might take fate into our own hands! Into your hands, perhaps? But what of the other worlds, your Radiance? With every calamity, you obliterate a star and every soul that dwells on it. To the Asians, we are all but tiny, momentary specks within an indifferent universe. We cannot hope to oppose them until we have been made whole once more. Are these 
truly the words of Garlemald's ruler. The flaws and foibles which you so abhor are what make us who we are. Every nation, even yours, Emperor Varys, is made whole through the combination of these imperfections, the strengths of one compensating for the weaknesses of another. Alrighty, alrighty. While it is true that man succumbs all too often to anger and avarice, he Smooth may yet talker. overcome his baser instincts through the forming of bonds with others, fostering community and cooperation. That the protector of an empire should not only reject these fundamental truths, but seek to change them at so dear a cost to life is indefensible. Such a man is not fit to govern. Love her. I love her. I would die for and her. You, warrior of light, would you refuse me as well? Um, well. I cannot condone such a loss of life. We can defeat the Asians as we are. I cannot condone such a loss of life. I never saw a loss of life, but I must have a me. I love how all my honeys are on the same side as me. It would seem the Alliance is of one mind on this matter. You Aeorzeans never cease to disappoint me. Yeah, and you guys don't ever cease Though I suppose I have only myself to blame for expecting more from savages. Jesus! This discussion is at an end. I bid you make ready for our next meeting. It will not be at the negotiating table. He wants to fight me. What's beef? Well, sir, I'm a vegetarian. No, I ain't fucking scared of you. I came. Oh, my back. I came back to find Doma's advance party ready and waiting for battle. So as worrying as a little chat with the Emperor was, it did buy enough time for at least some of our allies to arrive. Tea! <laughs> Having listened to Emperor Ran, man, 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 oh my god, are we fighting? Is it duty time? Is it trial time? Is it combat time? The secret quest! bad ending <laughs> I'm not sure what I was expecting from our meeting with the Emperor but it wasn't that still at least we know now what he's really after I a future built on a mountain of bodies I too want the Asians dead but not at any cost the last of the reinforcements from Dorma arrived not long ago I pray it will be enough Given the Emperor's stated goal, this is a battle we can ill afford to lose. If the Galleons come in force, we may not have much say in the matter, even with our combined strength. We knew from the first that the odds would be against us. But if there is even the slightest chance of victory, we must do everything in our power to seize it. Amen, King. We must seize it, full stop. <laughs> hey, yo, for real, for real, full stop. Here, here. Did I ask my guy? The two of you are to join an irregular unit and support the main host. I won't bother asking if you're minded to fight. After coming this far, how could I not? And for once, there's no one around to count on me. 
Not that they would. Not even my brother. But we all know who really make the difference. Ready to frighten some Garleans? Dialogue choice? Oh. I just found a nod. I wouldn't want to be on their side. Might I ask you to accompany the Dorman contingent? They are strangers here, and your presence would do much to raise their spirits. Of course. We would be honored. When our people stride out with you in their midst, I dare say the Aeorzeans will feel an ilm taller themselves. High spirits have a way of spreading. I want to feel taller. What's that uh, like? What I wouldn't give to join you. But my duties as field commander will not allow it. I'll leave the front lines in your capable hands. Comrades, ready your arms. The hour of battle has come. May the crystal guide us to victory! Yeah, get N Walker. I think they're on sale right now for like 30 bucks. You get the entire, like, you get the base game and all the X packs for like 30 bucks. Pretty good. Since the others couldn't be here, we'll have to fight twice as hard. If Alphano wakes to find the Imperials have won, I shall never hear the end of it. <laughs> it's strange. I thought I would be terrified when the fighting started. I should be terrified. But with you at our side, I can't help feeling everything is going to be all right. So please, don't you dare leave me alone. I won't. I couldn't. Oh, I could never. You're my little baby. No matter what happens, we have to survive together. Why do I look so shocked? That was very sweet. I love little Alize so much. Is that it? Is, is that all we need? Is it a light party? Last I saw you were still in Doma, like in 4.0 like a week ago. You've come so far so quick. I have. Oh wait, I don't want to play Dragoon. I don't. Should I play Dragoon? Should I play Dragoon? What are you, what are y'all playing? What are y'all playing? We will adapt to- they'll adapt to me? Do I want to Dragoon this? Do I want to Dragoon this? Do I want to tank this? Hello, I'm also obsessed with Final Fantasy XIV. How about all of you? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty much there. I am also obsessed with it. Tank is fun in this. Okay. Tank, I don't. It's toy base. Join us as emotional fan press reliving the emotional moments. <laughs> Sad to leave Tombury, but I finally transferred my main to and I Oh Goblin time! We're all calling for more victory in the shadows! 
Our eyes just start- your eyes just start glowing? <laughs> Alright. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Are we ready? Chat, you ready? I'm a little scared. <laughs> I'm a little scared. Oh, this triumphant ass music. Wow, we're so colorful. <laughs> Oh god, I haven't tanked in a hot minute. Oh god, okay. Okay. Forward, forward. How far can I go? How far can we go? How far can we go? How far can we go? Can we go this far? This far? Does this work? That is a big... That is a big AOE. That is a... That is a... Ah! There we go. <laughs> this is this is going really well. This is this is going exquisitely. Oh, I just realized Hien is with us too. Two pulls per section. Okay. Well, this is going swimmingly. Nothing bad is happening, chat. Nothing bad is happening. I'm a professional. I'm a professional. I'm a. I'm a pro. I'm a pro. I'm in the. I'm in the. I'm in. I'm. In, I'm, in, I'm okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Everything is okay. I anticipated this. We collectively anticipated this. Big gold guy. That's a big gold guy. Mark! What up, Mark? I wonder how far I should bring him up. Should I bring him up a little further? Is he gonna move? Is he is he gonna move? Will you move? Will you come up a little bit? No? Oh, okay. Well, oh you will. Alright. Or okay, okay. Oh, okay, what's that? What is that? What does this do? What does that do? What is that? Okay, so I'm gonna go here. Is he, is, please tell me he's going this way again. Or is he going to. Oh! Oh, okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay. Oh my god, he's doing it again. He's doing it again. Sir!
Should I be stacking this tank too? I should, right? I never really asked that before. I feel like I should be. Yours, yours stack, yours, yours stack as tank as well. Yours, all right, all right, Jen. Yours, I will. Yours. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> All right. Oh God, oh God. Is my ability not going off? Oh, it's too far. I'm guessing this is the last spot. No? Maybe? Maybe? Can I- can I go further? Can I go further? I- I- Oh! Oh! This way! Oh! I'm going further! There's more! I can keep going! Okay, and I guess this is where we stop then. Okay. Eh. 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 Ah! I pressed the wrong button! I pressed the wrong button! I know, I know, I know it's not gonna- It's not, it's not- Oh my god, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Is it gonna, is it gonna- Are we all good now? Okay, I'm good. Can someone remind me to adjust the, the cone sensitivity on my, on my controller? Can someone ping me in, in, um... Not now! But can someone in the server, in the Final Fantasy chat, ping me to adjust the code setting? Back. Or sense? Okay, okay, where am I going? Where am I going? This way? Can I, can I pull here? Or do I just fight? What do I do here? What do I do here? Do we go? Do we go? Do I go? Do I go? Can I keep going? Oh my god, where do I go? Do I go this way? Can I go this way? I don't know where to go. Oh, there's fire, never mind. I cannot go this way. I'm doing great. I'm doing great. I'm doing amazing. This is all going according to plan. Wait, who's the boy? What boy? Did I miss something? I heard a boy, but I didn't register a boy. Was there a boy? Pippin, my boy, my little man, my sweet baboo. It was Pippin. Okay, can we go through here now? I can't. Prometheus. That was a good movie. Oh, I don't have my my thing. Very good. Very cool. Very cool. Very fun. Uh. Mm, 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 don't think I like that. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> I see. I understand now. <laughs> I'm turning you around the best that I can right now without getting sensory overload. We ball. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that.
crazy. <laughs> oh. Sir? Sir? You had but one job. And it was to keep my ass alive. <laughs> and you couldn't even do that. An accept acceptable loss indeed. Better him than me. He's a short king, no, you're so you great. Underestimate me. Looks like titties or balls falling from the sky. Just wasted my ability. How dear oh, well, I guess it's following me anyway, so Another? Why did I? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. I figured more guys would spawn because, like, there's no way it was just that four and then the boss fight. do hmm? oh, 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 oh. am I fighting these two milfs 
A savage's bastard vanguard? Impressive. But in the end, they are only that. Savages. Now let us be brief. His radiance awaits? I don't know what that last word was, I missed it. So they're like twin milfs? I grief the hell out of this dungeon when Emmerich showed up because I had to blow him kisses. Me. Relatable. Okay, I just, I, I used the wrong ability there. That's fine. Um, is there only one? What? Oh. Okay. What happened here? Don't you have to like knock these away or something like that? Get out of the AOE for them? That's from another- that's a- that's a thingy from another dungeon, right? I don't know what one it was. Hello? Oh, oh no, oh, oh, oh. Is she not, is she not dying? Is she not, is she not dying? Is she, okay. Julia and Anya, obsessed. Ah! Oh, whatever, like, the, the, oh, the, the, the path, okay. I'm seeing, I'm understanding. Oh, no, nothing yet. I can't, I. her a little further when that when those abilities appear. Okay. 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 You have no choice? What are they talking about? Are they gonna like morph into one? Who are they who have witnessed this twice? Or are they just Um I'm gonna go right here. What are they gonna do? Are they gonna fuse? Farewell, savage. What are they doing? What is, what's happening? Can I, can I attack? Do I attack? Is it pointless? Is it fruitless? Okay, we did the thing. It's definitely not done, <laughs> but we did the thing. We have served our purpose. Come, we sh I missed it. Fuck. I'm smoke bombing out of there? Yeah, okay. Wait, that's it? That was actually it? No, there has to be something else. There has, to, there has to be something else. Mm. 
Tank. Thanks for accompanying me. I may have to see you again, presumably. I'm assuming there's gonna be something else. So, thanks for accompanying me. Let's continue on with this fucking thing so I can finish this goddamn post Stormblood nonsense. Oh. Okay. Can I eat my food now? There you are. Good luck. And none the worse for wear. Mean, good luck. Indeed. I had hoped we might do more to help, but there seems to be no one left to fight. Two more after this? A Hell tactical yeah. withdrawal, perhaps? Not safe to eat, but I want, I want a bite. We should I give chase. Finish them off while we have the chance. Just one bite. Imagine the other surprise when they wake to find the war already won. Oh! No, 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 no will expunge all life. Only you can It sounds storm like the warrior the of darkness. It sounds like the warrior of darkness. Throw wide the gates. I think that's the warrior of darkness. No, 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 no. Oh, Ali say, Ali say no, Ali say no, 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 no. Oh. oh, what's happening? Wait, what's happening, what's happening, what's happening? Oh no, don't tell me. Are you all right? Baby. Quickly, we must get her back to the encampment. Yoshi P! My baby! My sweet papa! She's fine. They're fine. They're fine. She's fine. My baby's fine. She's fine. It's okay. Nothing bad is gonna happen because they gotta get their souls back. She's fine. My baby. Oh, Yoshi P giveth and taketh once again. Oh. Garlands have been routed, have they? Well done. Though this exchange was no more than a test of our strength, like as not. We won't be taking any chances now that the Emperor has joined the fray. They'll want to take their time, whittle down our defenses. Still with your help. That of our Eastern allies. We've passed the first test. Our line is unbroken. As for Alize, well, she's in good hands over at the infirmary. My lord, the- it's, it's Chirurgeons, right? Chirurgeons? Chirurgeons? I've completed their examination of Mistress Alize, and it is as we feared. She is locked in a slumber without any outward cause. <laughs> My bugaboo! Just like the others. Damn it all. Alright, the Garlands picked a fine time to come knocking. Five scions incap incapacitated, and with the enemy on our doorstep, I cannot spare the- Did I just miss something? No, I didn't. Um... And with the enemies on our doorstep, I cannot spare the men to assist in the search for our cause. The best I can do is see to it that Ali says, Of course, if anyone writes on you! Mm. Gear and I would return to our encampment. The main contingent of our forces from the far east is under sail, and all must be made ready for their arrival. I'll not keep you then. For that, I deserve a little bite of my Indian food, okay? Judging by the Garland's recent movements, or lack thereof, they won't be launching another offensive in the immediate future. Look, just one bite. Just one bite. Tonight! Why the fuck would I wait? 
We should turn to the rising stones. Given the plight of your fellow scions, Scions, I can understand if you feel on edge. You would be no good to anyone without rest. Thank you. I'm a very sleepy gal. I like my sleep. <sighs> I hope she's okay. I hope they're okay. I hope the twins are okay. I hope they're fine. Can't lose my babies. I can't lose my babies. I go take nap though. It's nappy time. I gotta go take nap. <laughs> no tears in the food though? I got no promises, Jay. No promises. This is war, Jay. <laughs> Stormblood. And I took that personally. Ruben, 56. Ruben, thank you for the 56 month resub. Holy moly. 56 months? God damn. Chat. How we feeling? We feeling good? I'm feeling like a hot mess. I feel like a mess. I'm absolutely loving the post storm blood content. I love this. There is so much happening. And this is what I expect. This is what I expect from um from the MSQ, not fetch quests, not garbage like you know, things that don't build the world or the characters. This is so good. There is so much happening here, and I'm I'm loving it. I'm in shambles, though. I'm a mess. I'm a wreck. But, like... Oh. <sighs> ah, Pepper. Welcome home. Word has it you and Mas Mistress Alize give the garlands quite a thrashing. Speaking of whom, where is Miss... Oh, Mistress Alize? I said she would have returned by now. Well... Let me tell you! By the twelve, not her too. Ochre? And I will ready the infirmary for her arrival. We will also need to send a message to Tataru post haste. Well, that I had something other than grim tidings to share with her. And with you too, for that matter. It gives me to report that the Archon's condition remains unchanged as we speak. Bultanet? Kryle and Master Matoya continue to explore every possible avenue. Alas, their efforts have yet to bear fruit. But all is not lost. You still you are still hale and whole, after all. Though I suspect you must be tired from your journey. You should rest, my friend. Leave the worrying task for the time being, at last. Okay. So another thing that I love too. I know when the don't leave me alone, I know, I know. I know, 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 I feel like I failed her, I feel like I failed her, but she'll be okay. Kelsey, it's fine. I'm used to Jay stabbing me repeatedly and then twisting the blade. Jit, not you two. Not you two, Jit. Well, what I was trying to say is that I love these, like, moments where in cutscenes they have the character, like, kind of, like, look at the camera and, like, talk to me. It helps so much with like the immersion and they do they do it very rarely but they do it in like certain moments where like tension is high or whatever and it's like it just like 
the dialogue just kind of like hits like it's like oh yeah they're talking to me not just the warrior of light they're talking to me and i love that like yes bitch i'm going to go take a nap thank you Meanwhile, the Imperial Palace. Me, 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 me. Oh. Meanwhile, the Port of Alamigo and the Pip Pip Pip. Is that Ashley Tisdale? Fucking Ashley Tisdale. This bitch. Oh no! Wait. I just took a screenshot, I think. Oh no! Wait! Oh no! Oh no, 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 uh What's gonna happen? Miss Ma'am Ashley Tizzle is at the border of Alamigo. The baba was they, they thought they won. They did not. Ashley Tizzle has come back for the next sequel of the High School Musical. Sharpay returns. Sharpay is here. Ah, uh, Pepper, yours is a welcome face indeed in these troubled times. Though if you've come to inquire about our stricken brothers and sisters, ah, I'm afraid I have not to report. Ah! Uh, who, who the fuck is Coltonet? 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 And the others continue their tireless search for answers, and I too have done all in my power to assist them. Alas. My pod is just now, so I have not been by here, and I wish to see if it's going to Who is it? 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 Oh. Well. Maximakama. Maximus? Max, ma'am? Maxima. <laughs> Mistress Pepper, I've heard about the part you played in driving back the Emperor's forces. Thank you. But you were able to stop them, if only for a short while. It gives me hope. I realize how strange such words must sound coming from a Garlean's lips, but I speak them out of the love I bear for my homeland, because I wish to see an end to the bloodshed. That is why I chose to share all that I know with the Alliance. Though I will surely be branded a traitor, I'm content to bear that... Ignominy? 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 But enough of my prattling. The war is not what brought me all this way. I came to see Master Alfino. An acquaintance of Pepper and Alfino, are you? Well, far be it from me to turn away good company. If you fall if you will follow me, sir. Am I okay? I hope so. I don't know. Show me the boy. Show me the babies. When word reached me that Alfino had returned, it seemed only right that I visit him. Poor lad. It pains me to see him thus, but I take solace in the knowledge that he is safe and well cared for. He fought valiantly at the bum. So did I. So did I. <laughs> that calamity was a force to be reckoned with, I tell you. <laughs> he fought valiantly at the burn. The popularis could not have wished for a much for a more committed ally. I must 
I know not how he came to be so afflicted, but I pray a cure will be found soon. On an unrelated note, you may be interested to know that I traveled here in the company of another acquaintance of yours. He awaits my return at North Silvertier, and I am certain he'd be glad to see you. Assuming he's for the time, that is. Okay, 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 okay. Can I, can I, can I, can I, can I guess? Can I guess? Can I throw some guesses? Can I guess? Can I guess? I have, I have a guess. I have a guess. Okay. Wait. I have a guess. Do it on the way. No, I, I. It's me, Vosk. Shut up. I. I think I think I know who it is. I think I know. I think I know who it is. 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 I I know I could be wrong. I'm I'm hyping myself up. I'm hyping myself up. Is it a cat boy? I'm putting on my glasses. I, my vision is like really bad. I don't even know where my glasses are. Because isn't this where like we fucking like met him and had to do all those like shebangs? Is and it, and like Where are my glasses? Where did I put them, chat? Chat, I cannot see. I took off my glasses to cry and now they're gone. Oh, I found them. No, if it's not a cat boy, who could it be? Because everyone is knocked out. And it's not someone I was just with, unless they fucking brought Orshifon back from the dead. No, not getting my hopes up. No, he's long gone. Ugh. Oh look, it's a cat boy! I was right! There is a cat boy here! I'm trying to think. Who could it be? Oh, I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Could it be? Who could it be? I'm here? Who could it be? Is it this? Is, is it Sid? Is it is it is it Daddy Sid? Is it is it Daddy Sid? Is it is Daddy back? Oh my god! Oh my god! It's not like you've been through the mill. You should have called me. I should have. I know. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I know I could have left a voicemail. I could have done a lot of things, and I didn't. I got wrapped up in business. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Though I must confess, tracking down missing souls isn't exactly within my field of expertise. I don't know what it is about Sid, but every time I see him, it feels like Christmas. Maybe it's because he looks like Santa. I don't know. As you may have surmised, I heard much of Master Garland growing up in Garlemald. Indeed, he has long been a source of inspiration to me. Oh no, wait. Catboy's dead, isn't he? Did he get, like, locked up in that, like, raid? In the Crystal Tower. Most Garlands would say he is a traitor, that he turned his back on his country. We of the Popularis, however, consider him a revolutionary, a revolutionary, a man, well, if he's, I don't know, a man willing to defy the Empire's dreams of subjugation, that his inventions might bring about a better future for all mankind. Please. Revolutionary is a term that, term best reserved for my work. I am but an Imperial defector who thought to aid another Imperial defector. Whatever Master Garland says, I am humbled to find myself in such distinguished company. Speaking of distinguished company, we heard from Roban that you ran into an old friend in the burn. Is it true? Guy still lives? Mm. Like most in the army, I never had the privilege of seeing the Legatus without his mask. I think I walked halfway across the burn in the presence of the Black Wolf. And he claimed to have severed ties with the Empire Tandassians, did he? I'm gonna put this on auto so I can like fix my cat ears. Mm. After his humbling in the, at the Praetorium, one would think he'd have good sense to stay dead. <laughs> Should we meet again? I shall be sure to tell him so. Oh, I can't, I cannot fix it. Commander Alden also spoke 
of the alliance meeting with the emperor. Though I still labor to believe, whatever, I'm not fixing this, um, to believe what he told us. Does Radius really claim that Garland was founded by the Asians? Yeah, I still don't get that shit. But this is madness. The very notion is absurd. Every fiber of my being uh, rails against it. And yet I see there's no escaping the truth. From the very founding of my homeland, my brothers and sisters have laid down their lives in service to a lie. So the story goes. That's life. That's literally life. The Asians must be stopped. To save my people. To save all peoples. For all the emperor, the empire's many crimes, even I did not suspect. Had I known, I would have left a lot sooner. But that is in the past. Here in the present, we must apply ourselves to the problem of how the empire's ambitions may be thwarted, not only in Eorzea, but in the Far East as well. The Ironworks will spare no effort to achieve that end. Serious Wall was a good start. We can do more, and we will. We'll show them what it means to achieve freedom through technology. Okay, Elon. Beg your pardons. I bear message for the Warrior of Light. That's me. Hi. Commander Alden requests your presence at, at Alliance Headquarters in Alamigo. I swear to God, if I fucking go back to Alamigo one more time, you would discuss matters of strategy at your earliest convenience. Ah, yes, the inevitable messenger. I knew it wouldn't be long before duty called you away. Time, no doubt, being of the essence. Could I tempt you to ride aboard the Excelsior? If there's a faster way to robot inside, I'll personally plan to the commander if I keep him waiting. You can take me for a ride. I don't mind. <laughs> oh, we have what? I swear, every time you board my airship, you seem to be barreling headlong into danger. <laughs> and every time you somehow, you somehow contrive to emerge victorious, which, of course, is an admirable, admirable skill. Sid? But no one's invincible, Pepper. Not even you. So please, take care of yourself out there. Thank you, Sid. I pray you remain safe on the front lines. Though ill-equipped to join the fray, I shall do all I can to assist from the headquarters. My colleagues and I have been tasked with evacuating casualties by air. See that you aren't among them, eh? Huh? Are we on the last one? Is this it? Is this it? Is this it? Is this it? Are we getting another stream tomorrow? Um, maybe. I'm going to the ballet. And I probably won't be home until like... Uh, 10 to 11. So if I do go live, it may not be main story stuff. It may be side quest things. Or, um... Like dailies. Like just hangouts, you know? Um, but Wednesday for sure I'll also be live and I'll be, um, going through the MSQ. A Requiem for Heroes? Oh, 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 ooh, ah, uh, ooh, ah, uh, uh, ooh, ah, uh, I like that title. <laughs> Despite the apparent urgency of Roban's summons, Resistant Fighter seems content to wait for your signal to proceed. Sorry, I'm showing my teeth. Commander Alden is waiting, my lady. It'd be best if you proceeded to the Alliance headquarters at once. Are you ready? I guess so! Can I make it ring? Oh, there he is. What's up, daddy? This is a duty. You're here. Good. I summoned you to discuss strategy. But first, I would apprise you of the Garlean's movements. Upon speaking with Robans. <gasps> Robots and cutscenes will play in sequence. It is recommended that you send us less of a time to be this season of diary. And there's a du I'm alone. I'm so alone. I'm so alone in this. I I ah okay. There have been several skirmishes along the border, but as yet neither side has delivered a decisive blow. Make sure I'm the class I want to be. We had long assumed that the Garleans would overwhelm us in a straight fight. Well. <laughs> but we seem to be gaining ground, albeit slowly. As to why that might be, the most likely explanation is that they have yet to commit all their forces. Still, we're winning, 
and our latest intelligence suggests the Emperor has retreated back to Garlemald. In light of this, we're considering launching an offensive with the aim of pushing the front line forward and giving ourselves some room to breathe. Some room. Commander! The Imperials! They've broken through our defenses to the east! Oh my god, oh my god. What? I knew it, our I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Our are being led by Lord Zeno. Ashley Tisdale strikes back! I told Lord you! Lord Heon and Commander Hex have taken their troops to provide support. But we don't know how long they can hold out. Oh no, oh no, 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 So no, they've no. been biding their time, waiting for his arrival, oh, have no, they? No, 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 no. Very well. Send word to our allies, requesting reinforcements for the front hey, line. There's a rainbow back there. They're allies. Should the worst come to the worst, I may need to enter the fray myself. But what of you? Do you still have the strength to fight? Um, debatable. You need only say the word so long as you leave the Asian to me. <laughs> He may not die as such, but to see Lord Zenos fall on the battlefield would deal a heavy blow to Imperial morale. This is the part I'll where see to he it the dies once clear. and for all. Oh, sorry. Oh! Why won't they open? Please, I bid you open. That's the war. I know that's that is the warrior of darkness. I know I that has to be. I know that voice. What's wrong? Is it the voice again? Are you sure you're in a fit state to do this? Mm. May Ralga grant us strength. Give him hell, lass. I, for my part, will defend this place to my dying breath. Famous last words? Thank you for the hydration. Appreciate it. Meanwhile, the board of Alamigo. Are they going to make me... Am I going to get to fight as Hien? Am I in daddy? Wait, am I... Am I actually? Am I actually? <gasps> I am! Hold your on till the warrior of light arrives? Okay? I don't know how to play samurai. I don't know what any of these do. I have not a clue what these do. Weak! Oh. What does this do? Is it just... Oh, it changes every time I use it. Yeah. Is he focused on me? He is. Yeah. Oh. oh, oh, oh. I did not like that. This one's for you, Ada. Wait, is this like is this like a is this like range? Is this, oh it is! Cool! It like shooshes me in. Okay, so what is what is the better what is the better ability here? Yeah. What is the what, oh, oh, oh. What remember, do I stay close to these? I think I do. Do I? Oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Crikey. I'm really glad we have a healer with us. And I'm really glad I already used um second wind. I'm so, I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Yeah. I'm so grateful. Really happy about that one. Oh, hey. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. I 
got a little heal in that. His HP is still so high. It's literally so fucking high. Okay, so that's like a charge. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god. Here I come again. I can't tell what, what does more. Based of my true power? Oh god. Oh no, oh my god. Oh, oh no. Oh, wait. He's only pulling me into the center. Oh, what do I do? Here it comes! Oh. Wait, what is she? Oh! <gasps> she swapped with me! The what is she of doing? Shinobi's power. Ooh! 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 The art God damn! Ah, uh, I'm- I'm coming! I'm coming! Do you just- start just- Yeah, we split it! Yeah! Yeah, I like how they're- they're holding out until I arrive. But I'm- we're doing like two damage. This is- you got you gotta last a long time, babes. Oh, did that oh did I go in too soon? Oh I gotta heal. We're good. Oh, stop facing me. Come, does she? I do. I do come. I. I'm. I'm on my way. I do be coming. Oh please no. Please. No. Pepper, do not let him die. Do not let her die either. What are those fists made of, babes? Go, Pepper, go! Go, Pepper, go! Oh. They're not. They're not. They're not. They're not. They're literally not. Magic. With a Garlean body. That's hardly fair. Still, he must be stopped, no matter the cost. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, that's me! That's my feet! My pitter patter! My tippy taps! I don't even have my sword out. I'm not even. P I'm ah, just standing there like an NPC. Bringer of light. It has been too long. Oh, is it my turn? No words to mark our reunion. <laughs> so be it. Equilibrium must be restored. And only your death 
will redress the balance. I'm not that special. Come on, game, load me in. Why am I, why am I even? I was like, oh yeah, oh my god, I have to position him. There's no one with me. So what did the, I don't even know what those abilities do. These two up here? No, I think I do. I just don't remember. <laughs> and I don't think I can stun him at all, right? Yeah. That's not very nice. Don't call me weak. Everyone's not gonna like that. I am doing significantly more damage. Oh, oh is that the is that his black rose? Is that the black rose stuff? Took so long to go off. This music. Kind of. Oh, what is this? What is that? Oh, that's sick! So it goes like. Shh, shh, shh. That's sick. La Habrea, but I will not be cast aside so easily. Lies. HP diff. Wrong thing, wrong thing. Why? Rude. Rude. You don't like it when you touch me like that. Oh, good. Is he gonna do that weird, like, round thing again? Oh, wait, should I run into these? What do I do with these? Oh! Do I do it? Oh, oh no, it stunned me. Something stunned me. Oh fuck, I should not be there. Do I, do I run into these? Should I run into these? Should I be running into yeah. these? I don't know. Should I be avoiding them? Oh, I should probably be avoiding them? Because I know in one of the raids, they have like, or not raids, one of the dungeons, they have those things come up and you have to like run into them so they don't hit the character in the middle. I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button, but I'm fine. He's almost dead, he's almost dead, he's almost dead. He's, almost dead. he's got like one HP. He's so dead. Take that! Easy. Easy. Easy peasy. Easy peasy peasy. 
those hurt you? Listen. Now I know. <laughs> and I didn't die, though. I didn't die. But is he dead? I somehow died. Oh my god, just being reanimated. Oh, I love this. Your mother chose her champion well. Yet, for all your strength, I do like that it's just you will saying still Dino, fail. So not his, like, full title. Ah! I was- I was just gonna fucking say- I was just going to say, watch the Warrior of Darkness intersect. I was just gonna fucking say, I was literally just about to say that. I was just about to say that. Ah, someone calls to you. Yeah, it's fucking Albert Bard Alderbar. Too late, alas. That's alternate universe J. I know it. It has to be. It has to be. It has to be. I'm gonna open these nuts before I open a gate. What's he gonna do? What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? Don't kill me, don't kill me. I'm cute. Oh, am I passing out? Where am I? This looks like the the place that I was in before, but like not fully. Wait. Where is this? This doesn't look like the Heidel and meeting spot. Is Minfilia gonna show up? At last, I found you. Please, there's no cause for alarm. Though, I confess, this is not where I had intended to meet. But the place of our meeting is of no consequence, like the war you wage. Win or lose, the path you walk leads only to a- ANTHONY BRIDGERTON! <laughs> the better path leads you here, to me. I have need of your strength. Such questions will have to wait. We have is this not Catboy? Your work is not yet done. This sounds like Anthony Bridgerton now. Go to the Crystal Tower. I can't. I can't tell if it's Anthony Bridgerton or if it's what's his face from Game of Thrones. It's Your one of them. It's, of one of them. it's one of them. It's one of them. It's one of them. It's one of those white boys. I don't know which white boy, but it's a white boy. All you need do is find it. It's one of them. I will take care it's of the rest. It's one of them. Well, at first I was saying it's the warrior of darkness, but then I just, I knew that I would see, I just knew that I would see him at some point. Sorry, I'm Soon like, I should have said that. We will throw wine to the I should have like prefaced with that. <laughs> oh. I did, I did. I said him, but earlier I was like, oh, am I going to see, am I going to see what's his face? Oh. Sorry, I'm just getting lost in my own un unspoken excitement. Is it him? I think it might be! It sounds like Anthony Bridgerton! I can't tell if it's Anthony Bridgerton or if it's the fucking Game of Thrones dude. I don't remember his name. What was the Game of Thrones dude's name? What was his name? I don't know if it's someone different! I don't know! I'm just speculating at literally four 
a.m. Wait, I'm awake. Wait, I'm alive. Wait, I didn't die. Wait, I'm chilling. You're awake. Thank heavens. <sighs> oh my god, it's 4 a.m. It's 4 a.m. It's 4 a.m. Was it not? Was it not 1 a.m.? Like, just an hour ago? No, not the dude who played Jamie. No, not the dude who played Jamie. The dude who played, um, the guy who liked, um... No, not... The guy who liked, um, Arya. What was his name? Ralph? No, not Ralph. <laughs> Gendry, the Brathian boy. Yes, Gendry, that's it. That's it. Because that, that's the voice of the warrior of darkness, I think, right? And, like, I thought I was hearing him, but then it was more clear, and I'm like, I... <laughs> Look, I got, a, I got a dumb crush on Anthony Bridgerton. <laughs> so I was like... <laughs> I was like, I know that voice. And I know he voices the cat boy. So once it clicked, I was like, what? I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I don't know. I could be wrong. It's 4 a.m. I'm a little delusional right now. I don't, I don't know. I see you recall that much, at least. Yeah, what happened to him? What happened to him after he tried slicing In me? the midst of your duel, it is said you faltered and that the Crown Prince seized the opportunity to deliver a mortal blow. Yet before his blade could find its mark, he was distracted by the arrival of a second adversary who bore you away from the battlefield and into the hands of our Chirurgeons. Chirur- Oh, so you do pronounce that R, okay. Chirurgeons. Lest you wonder, he left before you awoke. <laughs> As is his wont. Give me the flashback. Let me see it. Oh. Emirate, Emirate Estinian never was one for emotional farewells. Estinian, Estinian. Though Zeno spessed it all before him, the battle clearly took its toll, for he retreated shortly after your rescue. Seeing this, the remaining Imperial forces decided discretion was the better part of valor and pulled back, allowing us to re-establish our position. We have so since soft. received word of renewed unrest in the provinces, doubtless inspired by the efforts of the Aeorzean Alliance and our Far Eastern allies. Nor does the good news end there. We have also come into possession of intelligence suggesting unrest within the Imperial court. This would certainly explain why both the Emperor and Lord Xenos appear to have abandoned the fight. A long-awaited ray of hope in these dark times. Thanks to me. Thanks to me. Yet to awake, I'm afraid. But please, concentrate on your own recovery for now. I have anxiety. I can't do that. You have carried the hopes of some half dozen nations, and we are all eternally grateful for your efforts. But no one is without their limits, not even you. Leave this fight to us, my friend. You have earned your rest. Ah, but before I forget... What? I was asked to deliver a message as soon as you awoke. A reminder that you are not alone, Aww. though many of your allies have fallen. Aww. When you are well and rested, you are to return home, where friends will be waiting for you. I have friends? 
I've got friends. Thank you. Now, if you will excuse me, I must return to the front. May we meet again soon, under happier circumstances. My head is like buzzing. My head is buzzing. I have so many like thoughts <laughs> right now. And I can't even like formulate half of the- to hear that the war efforts can already be felt even here in Ishgard. In anticipation for a need of reinforcements, our Sherelle will soon be departing out for the front lines with a... Come on! Go! Go with the contingent of our finest knights. I would advise you to stay so you strike that return, but I know it would be in futility. Indeed, I suspect you've already decided on your next destination. A dark days lie ahead, and I have no doubt for the land of hope shall I begin. Like Jay said, the most I've cried during Stormblood was me remembering Heaven's War! <laughs> <laughs> I drink my water now. <laughs>
Okay. Um, should I t should I talk to him again? Man, <laughs> you know that you are. <laughs> I don't know where to go. <laughs> I don't, I don't know where to go. Okay. as soon as I could. <coughs> I swear, my heart nearly stopped when I heard you'd collapse like the others. What in heaven's name is going on? Win or lose, the path you walk leads only to oblivion. Oh, well, that's helpful. And what else did he say? The better path leads to him? Hmm... <gasps> if his is the voice you've all been hearing, perhaps the others are with him! Thanks. Sir Emmerich said the fighting had reached a stalemate, didn't he? But if that monster masquerade in a Xenos <clears throat> comes back? Thancred, Yastola, Uriange, Alphano, Alize. You're going to need all of them on your side to defeat him. Yeah. And I forbid you from going to face him on your own. Do you hear me? I'm not going to do that. I'm not going alone. So if you must leave, go and find the others. Bring them home. <clears throat> oh. Can I hug her? Please. <sighs> As for where to start, you said the stranger had left a beacon for you at the Crystal Tower, right? But how are you to find it, now that the tower has been sealed shut? There has to be a way. If anyone would know, it's Sid and the researchers of St. Coinax find. I wrote this fucking game. Don't you worry, we'll find that beacon for you. Meanwhile, the Imperial Palace. What? What could possibly be happening in the Imperial Palace? Where's the pretty boy? Or not the pretty boy? <laughs> <clears throat> 
Oh, it was just Ashley Tisdale and her mom. I pray you have good reason for abandoning the front. How could I remain there while the rumor that my son is possessed by a demon spreads like a sickness here at home? Oh, it's working, huh? Oh, I will sorry, not be made to fight for the throne a second time. But what of you? Did you not tell me you would destroy Eorzea's champion with the ease that one might swat a fly? <laughs> a minor setback. She will not escape me again. Where is your grandsire? I would have words with him. Yeah, where is that rat? How should I know? Do you hide from each other's sight as well? I imagine he's doing what all Asians oh, yeah, do. Oh didn't he say, like, they're not gonna see him again? Hmm. He must have found a way to take advantage he's of this turmoil. Guess. Men are not pawns to be played with, Asian. You underestimate us at your peril. This war will not be decided by you and yours. Man must choose his own fate, and I, for my part, will do all within my power to see Garlemald emerge victorious. Good luck with that. You gonna lose. This theme slaps. Black Rose. Pray forgive the intrusion, Your Radiance, but the requested preparations are now complete. We stand ready to begin production of Black Rose upon your order. Go in sicko mode. Oh, 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 he's going sicko mode. Oh, I hate it when they do those animations. <laughs> now, what are they credits? Yeah. Enjoyers Pog. I did it. Can I skip it or will I miss something if I skip it? You know? Dentist, thank you for the five gifted subs. I appreciate it. Safe to skip? Okay, cool. I hope you guys aren't lying. It'll just take me to a cutscene if there is one? Okay. Um, I should turn in the quest and then get to the thing, right? I knew you'd be all right. And to celebrate your turn, I made you this, a brand new traveling outfit. Oh, I do hope it fits. Um, <laughs> But now isn't the time to fuss over your measurements. I must go and speak with the researchers of St. Coin Coinox Find. You go and rest while we track down that beacon. What's in babes? Oh, is this the blue eyed uh, d dude? I, rem I remember this. Yeah, who the fuck is this? Who is this? My head. 
enemy. My friend, had I been but a step faster. That sounded like Sinos? I... Bloody savages! Yeah, that's whatever Asian is in Xenos, I guess, or A pity your hunt leads you elsewhere. Not that I am surprised. May you find joy in it. Grow stronger, more savage, and savor every triumph. Every triumph. Sir. In the meantime, I will reclaim that which is rightfully mine. My brain is going in a whole bunch of different directions again. to make of it. Is Xenos locked inside somebody else's body and then the Asian took over Xenos's body? Like, did they soul swap? <laughs> Is that a thing? Crystal Tower. In the midst of a requiem for heroes, a voice rings out across time and space! In fields of tranquil light, sow seeds of darkness! Or sow seeds. <laughs> now is it trailer time? Now is it trailer time? Is it Twaywa time? It's time! Um, how do I do this again? I log out and then I just pick credits and then I pick or whatever the heck, right? And then I go movies and titles and then I go Shadowbringers demo and title, right? Since that day. Oh my god. How many years have I waited? God, the animation. Moment. Oh, the animation is so fucking gorgeous. The Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> me. That's how I feel right now. Hey, leave it. No. Hey. 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 Leave it alone. Leave it alone. Thank you. Just like a game mechanic. Become what you must. <gasps> Dark Knight Cannon for Shadowbringers. That's sick. That's sick. That's sick! I know the theme. I don't know where I've heard it, but I know it. That feels so good to hear because I main Dark Knight. That feels so good. <laughs> oh. Oh. We made- we- we- we killed it! 
replay it girl girl i'm not replaying it i'm not i'm not replaying it we fucking we killed it i'm not, i'm not replaying it i'm not replaying it oh there's so many details i know there's okay you know what oh There you go! <laughs> the game said <laughs> The game said, oh you wanna replay it? Say less. I Is Hien and Yugiri like are they okay? Is Lise okay? I didn't see them in the trailer. It has to, so it has to be, it's Grahatia. That's him. He's the one, I, I do, How I, many years I still, I the warrior of, moment. the warrior of darkness has to come in somehow. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't understand. For the one that stood alone against And the the Uriel, Jay, and Ishtola are okay? They're fine? And he called her Master Matoya or Mistress Matoya? Like, do, is she carrying on Matoya's name? I don't know. The warrior of light. And I, I don't, I, I don't, and I don't know where the twins are. I haven't seen the twins. I haven't seen the twins. And Thancred is hot. Why would you make Thancred hot? And baby Minfilia, Minfilia reborn. There's just so much. There's just so much. You shade like you want him to. I know. They hurt. And here's me. There, there's my cameo. <laughs> this is my favorite part of the trailer. This little guy. He's so cute. <laughs> Literally! Literally! <laughs> Wait, I mean, there's Alfino and Alfino with a bow, but Alfino and Alfino with a bow are both wearing bows. So it's Alfino with a bow and Alfino with a bow. It's Alfino with a bow and Alfino with a bow. Okay, this looks like where we were fighting. Like, this looks like Alamigo. I could be wrong. What sayest thou, Master Matoya? Master the... Orion J is beautiful. Or defy it. He is gorgeous. Deny it? Look at him. He is so pretty. Deny? I am not wont to run from my troubles. God, this trailer is so good. Like, look! He just job switches at will! That is so sick! Why can't I will the I mean, I can't run, but this is so sick! He's like, oh shit, my glam didn't work. <laughs> Until our friend returns. Oh! I will hold the Oh! Line. Oh! Oh! That's the outfit that I bought from the Monk Station when I started the game. I bought it a year ago. I bought it a year ago and had no idea what it was. And it was like Pepper's main alpha for a while. Oh my god, it's that. Also, how the fuck does this happen? This town certainly has changed. And not at all for the better. Like, how does he. Like, where. If that's a gunblade, does that mean he's like a tank? Tank bread? I'm not going anywhere. I promise you, Minfilia. Look at her, she's baby! She's baby! This is 
tankard. <laughs> so I'm assuming we showcase this because maybe is this when Dancer and the Viera were introduced to the game? Or is this a character that I can sim for? I feel like this is their weird way of being like, oh, Dancers, Vieras! Yeah? Oh, and, and the, yeah, okay, yeah, got it. This ha this is Grahatia. This tragedy, greater even than and the you... seventh umbral calamity, must be undone. Because he was locked in the Crystal Towers. Anthony Bridgerton! If history must be unwritten, let it be unwritten. Become yeah. what you must. Ooh, this shit, this part. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Become the warrior of I'm darkness. So, I'm so. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm so excited! I'm so excited! I'm so excited to play Shadowbringers! I'm gonna take my time with it though. I'm gonna try to like, like really take my time with it and like explore like the side content um, because I burnt through Stormblood because I fucking hated it. <laughs> oh. Oh. I'm just gonna open up the, um, the main menu. Um, it is 4.36 a.m. chat. I look like I got hit by a truck. I look like a disaster. Maybe we've in the Stormblood raid too. Yeah, I do have um some Stormblood content that <laughs> that I need to um get through. Ah. <sighs> my ear my head my head said bent my ear so bad you see that man that was so good that poor post that post stormblood content i have i have so i have so many feels I feel like I'm getting slapped in the face by Lord Edmont. And honestly, I'm I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. I didn't expect that. When the scene with Emmerich was like playing out, I was thinking, I was like, because I saw him come in with um a Manalane or Arturel's like little like handmaiden kind of chick, whatever. Um, I think it's Arturel's, like, his buddy or something, right? No, not Arturel, Manalane. Um, and, like, the gears were, like, turning in my head. I was like, am I in... I was like, am I in Ishgard right now? I'm fine. I'm okay. I'm good. <sighs> I was so good. I'm so glad that I, I plowed through it. <laughs> I had actually completely forgotten about that when I looked up. And I was chatting with Jin, we were both like, oh, this is gonna fuck her. <laughs> and it did. Raw. Ishgar will forever be my warrior of lights cannon home. Me too. Me too. I 
feel like I don't have any like thoughts right now that are like coherent. I feel like all of my thoughts still like fall back on Heaven's War. Like I still want to just talk about it so badly. But no, that was really good. I I'm really in I really enjoyed the pacing of that and I feel like that was a lot more comfortable than what I have to go through in like Stormblood and A Realm Reborn. Um, it was a little bit more reminiscent of Heaven's War where everything was just really enjoyable and kept me on my toes and wanted me it made me want more. Um, and so I'm hoping that the rest of the game follows that same pattern. Um, I I really want to know what's happening with the voice in our head. Like, is it Grahatia like speaking out to us and like fucking with us? Is it somebody else? Is it like an acid thing? Like, why are they knocking out? Where are their souls? Are they stuck in a tower too? Am I gonna have to go through a raid to get them back? Like, I don't, I don't know, but, um, clearly they're okay at some point. I don't know about the twins. I'm so nervous about the twins. I really, the babies, my boobas, my little boogie boogies. I really hope they're okay, especially Alize. And it was cute that they showed us, um, Gabu again. That was a character that I never actually thought that I would see again. So, even, I'm, I'm sad that he was in the same, like, traumatized state that he was in from before, where, like, he wouldn't speak or anything. It would kill me in the best way possible if, like, by Endwalker or something, you go and see him again with the twins, assuming that they're okay, and Gabu, like, talks again. I wish we got the full cutscene of Asinian saving the world of light and leaving her in Emmerich's care. I know, but shout out to fanfic, am I right? Just go buy an Orchard body pillow to hold that night like the rest of us will, just as human beings. You know what? That's a good idea. Um, uh, I have this guy. And when I'm streaming, he makes me feel better, but I think you're right. I think I need a body pillow. It'll be my first body pillow. <laughs> I'm not doing that. Oh, man. How are we feeling? Chat, do we feel good? It's bedtime for me. Alright, I'm heading to bed. Me too. Yeah. It is 441. But I hope, I hope you're all feeling good. Thank you for hanging out with me during that, that ride. The seven, the seven hour stream. We fucking did it. We fucking did it. We made it. I doubt anybody is online right now. But I will check nonetheless. I'm so proud of me. And I'm so proud of y'all for hanging out with me. There are some of you that have been here since the start. Bless you. Bless you. Oh, man. We're gonna raid. We're gonna raid. Who are we gonna raid? Are we gonna raid somebody? There's nobody. There's nobody online. There is literally no one online. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna send y'all over to my friend, Dan. He's lovely. We've raided him before. He's super sweet. He's playing X4 Foundations. I have no idea what that is, but we'll just send him. I'll send y'all his way. Thank you guys again so much for hanging out with me. Um, I may be live tomorrow, but if I am, I'll just be doing side quest content. I won't actually be doing the MSQ. Um, or we'll start it with one quest, but not actually like, you know, um, but I hope to start Shadowbringers, um, by Wednesday, and, sorry, I'm, like, seriously at such a loss of words, but we will be starting Shadowbringers at the latest Wednesday, and I will be taking my time with it, I want to actually enjoy it, we're gonna go slow, and that's about it! Uh, don't forget to follow me on social media and to join my Discord server that you can stay up to date with all of my shenanigans. Bye, friends. Have a good night. <laughs> and... A smile better suits a hero.